Hey, oh, folks. Give me one minute. Because nothing is working the way it should. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. I mean, give me just one sec. Can you... Can you hear game? Can you hear game? It should just be dragon tones. I can't tell if it's coming out of my headset or... No, it's coming out of my headset. Okay. Sorry about that, folks. How y'all doing? I hope y'all having a good weekend. RT Discord's new feature is absolutely bad, isn't it? Yeah! It is! Uh, but... Well, what can we do? Uh, what new feature they've added? Like, the kind of at tags that every other platform has. And it just makes it annoying. Uh, and the whatever all about is kind of stupid. Um... <laughs> is it because I have to mention I'm wearing my Discord partner hoodie? I do love Discord, but it's it's not not the brightest decision. Uh, <laughs> oh Jesus! What you gonna do now? How you all doing? I hope you all well. I hope you all having a fantastic weekend. I'll give you all just a chance just to hop on in before we get going. I, I think today should be a little calmer than fighting five Lynels, fighting the King of the Dragons, uh, going to the depths of hell. Uh, massive spoilers if you missed yesterday's stream. Like, we, we did so much. <laughs> the highlights are still kind of catching up. The highlights are about two streams behind, I believe, at the, at the moment. Um, but we're going to keep pr pressing on. We're going to have fun. We're going to do another long boy stream today. Uh, we're going to enjoy ourselves. Revert highlight messages rewards now? Nope. Nope. They're staying like that. <laughs> Some people ruined it for everyone. Nah, I mean... Well, listen. There's only one reason why you want to save points on this channel, and that's for the coveted gambling stream that happens, like, once a year or, like, you know, once every two years. I know, so to really drive that message home, the highlighted message feature is going to stay 1 billion, 111 million channel points. Hey, you're welcome to still redeem it. But good fucking luck. <laughs> good luck. Ah. <sighs> I'll, I'll reset it if I feel like it. I'm, I'm okay. It's been calm. How long would you need to watch to get that many cha channel points? I... <laughs> How many lifespans do you think it is? <laughs> like... I feel like it's not physically possible. Like, I, I, I feel like... You'd have to have, like, an entire family... Generations upon generations with the one Twitch account watching to actually accumulate enough channel points just to highlight one message. Like, I, I would be dead. I would be long dead by the time someone could redeem it. But I, I don't even know why you'd be like, getting the points at that point. When does RT game, the sequel, take over? <laughs> My successor has not been announced as of this time. My, my, my term is just continuing for now. I'm gonna just change the rules so it's always me. Oh god. But yeah. Hello everyone. How y'all doing? I hope y'all having a wonderful start to the day. Thank you to everyone that's been subbing already. You're all very welcome. Long boy stream today. Uh, we're gonna just play a bunch of Zelda. It's three in the afternoon. I'm set to go to like midnight. <laughs> Just because I've been having a lot of fun. Played a little off stream again uh, since yesterday. I uh, mapped some more shrines. Uh, I mapped some more of the underground. I got another battery. Uh, forever just trying to get the batteries because the batteries just... The batteries are just a bit of a grind and 
is not as exciting as the base game is. Like, it's still cool that it's here. But, like, the underground world and that. But it, it feels more so like a compliment or extra. It reminds me of, like, Bloodborne Chalice Dungeons is how I kind of look at it. Where it's, like, extra additional content just if you want it. But you don't really have to do it. That's how I kind of look at it. Okay. Let me see. I'm gonna gear on up. Welcome back. The Legend of Zelda. Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, we are on day seven of our not dying adventures. It's been going pretty well. We've only stubbed our toe at the start. Everything's been pretty safe. You know, we've had a very safe, conservative Let's Play. Um, with not much danger. Um, so anyway, we got Majora's Mask last time for defeating five Lionels in Hell. And today I thought we'd tackle like a deadly labyrinth, because it just happens to be down here. President Hudson has graced us as well. Our glider has been vastly improved since the last stream. Is the audio okay? I'm hearing it twice. I thought something was wrong. Hang on. I thought something was wrong. Hang on, I, I couldn't quite place it. Uh, give me one second. Uh... Why am I hearing it twice? That's better. Yep. Yeah. Stream's so good we gotta hear it twice. Yeah, that was, that was a little weird. I don't know. I don't, I'm not really sure why that was set that way, but pretty good. But yeah, welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, I really hope everyone's been enjoying the series. Thanks for all the support on these streams, too. Uh, I've absolutely been loving playing this. I'm very invested to complete it without dying at this point. I think we can actually do it. C considering, like, what we fought on yesterday's stream. Literally five Lionels back to back. <laughs> and the King Dragon. <laughs> Um, I think we stand a pretty damn good chance of doing it. And so that's what we're gonna try and do. Okay, we can... Yeah, we gotta wear Majora's Mask. We gotta get our mileage out of this. The fact that we even have it is absurd. Uh, its effect is wearing it makes it harder for certain enemies to spot you. I don't know how much this applies. I don't know how it's gonna work even with my... Well, my, like, D&D &D party that I've got with me. But we'll figure it out. He beat King Gliok. Uh, yes, I did. That was on yesterday's stream. That's how we started it. We also beat the Five Lionel Coliseum Challenge. Uh, which involved defeating a White Lionel. Which, oh yeah, um... I now have this. <laughs> Using one of its horns. Uh, turns out the Big Goron Sword is just a thing that was just under, like, Tarrytown or something? I just went down, and it's like, oh shit, it's just in a chest. So I have that too. Yeah, 91 damage sword. So that's, uh, that's pretty strong, to say the least. I finally used one of, like, the dra great dragon horns too, so we have this absolutely gorgeous blade. Like, look at this. So powerful. I used a bit of Zelda to make this as well. So we've been we've been doing well to say the least. Uh, we still have our, the President Hudson shield, which is the greatest shield in the game too. He's here for the adventure. Okay, let's see what the labyrinth puzzle is here. There's a little inscription here. You might notice that cave marker there. Apparently, there's a cave from the surface that led over here. I was just kind of doing a little explore, and then I realized, oh, hang on. 
This is just leading right into the labyrinth, so I backtracked. I'm only ever just doing little bits of exploring in that off stream, like things like map and shrines. I mapped like a little bit more of the underground, as you can see. We've kind of just been exploring there, kind of like made the rounds here a bit. Saving the juicy stuff and the good stuff for stream. There's so much game here that, I, I, you know, I, I hope that's all right. Research log day one. It's two days to reach this isolated island, though the ruins stood before us, we were too exhausted to explore. The weary tower was able to decipher the Zanai writing on the stone slab. The dragon ring slumbers in the labyrinth's depths. Wake it, and ye shall receive due compensation. While translation provided me with renewed vigor, the tower shortly thereafter felt ill with fatigue. I've seen him off on his way home, so I to tackle the ruins myself. The acorns and nuts I've prepared to mark my patch should set see to it that I do not get lost in set side. Okay, all right. Follow the acorn trail. So this this is like his lifeline, as he explored like the dangerous dungeon. Hang on, where does the where does the next acorn go? Acorns are going over here. Did he just turn around and go back? No, he's going off the side. Okay, and there, there are like little pits everywhere, it seems. I mean, this is one of the labyrinths where we could probably just jump to the top again. Uh, especially because we have like higher vantage points, but... I mean, we'll try and explore it. We'll give it an honest shot. Gotta leave the acorn trail here or we won't be able to find our way home. Man is dead. <laughs> uh, Tar Taro's alright. We know what Taro is. He's like off exploring other places. Little deep water pockets here. Acorn Trail continues. The labyrinth's not of enemies in them. It doesn't seem to be. No, like the the previous one didn't either. I was thinking that. I know before there were like flying guardians and stuff that you had to contend with. They seem to have really just put the focus on, hey, it's a labyrinth this time. And they don't want you dealing with anything else, I guess? It is a bit different, though. It's a little jarring to just not have anything trying to murder us. I mean, not that I'm complaining, though. You know? Uh, a strong Zanai sword. I... I can get rid of this. I don't really have... I mean, I do have stuff for breaking rocks, I guess. Strong Zonite's sword is always just good. Uh, I can upgrade just one of my shields for just a... Oh, wait, no, that's a weaker shield. Okay, hang on. A mighty construct bow. This one's got durability up a lot. This one's got attack up, maybe this one... Eh, it's new. I'll take it. I'll take it. Any pronunci pronunciation of Zanai hurts my soul. Well, Zanai? Zonai? Zenu? <laughs> Listen, like, we've established many a time in this channel, right? We don't discriminate. We pronounce everything wrong. Okay? Like, it'll be all right. It's pronounced Hyundai. <laughs> ah, thank you. I'm glad we've clarified that. I'm just curious if there's anything down the dead end passageways. Oh, God. 
Uh, Disco Dan, thank you for 100 bits. It would take a tier 3 sub about 528 years of stream watch time to be able to redeem the highlighted message. <laughs> okay, so just over half a millennium. For what? Like, I, I, now, I will be dead. I will be dead at that point. But you could have that highlighted message. Just think about it. Hey, here's his research notes. What carefully avoiding the stirring gloom, just one touch and it will invade the body in the blink of an eye. There's no gloom anymore, though. Found the princess and her swords when a delve beneath High Hyrule Castle. The gloom must like they got rid of it here at some point. It seems like kinda quite calm. I guess it's on the walls and that, but like that doesn't really matter, you know? Like unless you're like climbing up and like licking it or something, you know, you're gonna be okay. And re rebuild RT game stronger. I I'm just gonna be like like upload as an AI at some point, and that's just the live streams. It'll probably be far more entertaining than whatever we're doing here these days. Yo, God forbid we have human input, you know. Yeah. I'll just be the VTuber. Okay, burn this out. First time I ever catch you live, and it's almost 1 a.m. sobbing. I, I'm guessing you're part of the Aussie crowd. How's it going? <laughs> Good to have you here, nonetheless. Strong Zonite Longsword. Um, yeah, a Flame Emitter Club? Got high durability. I think I prefer the idea of this. I think I prefer it. I have something cool I can fasten to this as well. Hang on. I've been getting, like, so many good materials. Um, the Captain Construct Fourhorn. <laughs> Look at that. Just 40, casual 47 sword. And it's one-handed. This is a big sword, too. Pop another one of these uh, down, too. Casual 39 there. It's like, it's, it's so unbelievably strong. Look at all these, like, spitting blades I've got now. We got the Master Sword on top of all that, too. And hates everywhere that isn't Dublin, let's be real. Are you referring to this labyrinth in relation to Dublin? <laughs> My favorite place in the world is Tokyo. Hey, here's the shrine. Oh, because you hate France and now Australia. <laughs> Where does this hate in France coming from? <laughs> this was on the other stream the other day too, and I don't really understand. How, how, how dare he like, be awake in his part of the world at a reasonable hour in the afternoon? Jesus, he doesn't deny hate in Australia. What is this? Like, uh, you guys are just looking for beef. <laughs> Give us some drama, Dan. <laughs> what is, uh, uh, dude, I'm just trying to play Zelda.
is going on? Oh, don't start calling me a Brit now as well. Hang on, what's even- What? You're in a weird mood today, chat. You're in a weird mood today. I'm just reading it and it's like, what's going on? <laughs> Beef. <laughs> okay, for you have conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of dragons, have unlocked a door. That was a really straightforward labyrinth. Like, that was just like a, a gentle walk. Now we have the actual hard one, which is in the skies above. Blow my labyrinth pro prophecy. Just finally led me to the Zanai Relic. I must hurry back and tell Tara all about it. Just my curiosity remains piqued. I'm not sure if I'm quite ready to leave these ruins. It's like, to see a lower level from this room, just how is one supposed to reach it? Oh. God, it's gonna be another dive into the abyss, isn't it? I think it's locked at the moment. Oh, God. Wait, no, I remember this chamber. This You have to fight, like, guardians in here in Breath of the Wild. They've got something worse now. <laughs> I'm not afraid of them. I think these guys are far scarier than Guardians ever were. <laughs> like, they scared the shit out of me. Okay, Phantom Ganon. He's got a new weapon. That's colossal damage. He's not as bad when he's got the club, in all honesty. It's a much easier fight. The Gloom Club. That's massive. That's a full 50 damage. Take another Demon King's bow. Like, th these are only getting stronger as time goes on. There's so much equipment as well. Like, look at the amount of just, like, the armory we have here. Of just powerful shit. So the these grow in power the more pizza hearts we get. So that's our fourth Demon King bow. Um... Okay, and I've I've got I've got a really stupid idea for this. Hang on. When we destroy that part. Oh look at that! The reach of it. Casual 90 damage spear. The longest stick. Yep. Like a big battery. Okay, is there anything else down here as of right now? There's a bubble frog here. the cave I think I found underneath the place. I think I've been most of the way through here. Yeah, this is this is where I decided to like kind of leave it when I started seeing the labyrinth blocks. It was like, huh, labyrinth uh, approaching. Yeah. 
Why haven't you used the weapon of the Master Sword? I don't really need that at the moment. The Master Sword is actually really good in its own. You can, you can fuse stuff to it, sure, but like, it's just been reliable. It's not really necessary. It gets the power-up bonus as well when you're near Gloom. Gloom Club Master Sword. Probably could have done it, but like, I like the novelty of a spear that just does 90 damage. Like, that's just insane to me. Okay, we need to get to the sky uh, for this. I think maybe we can make most of the way from the tower. Big damage on spear is the meta. Why would there be a meta for this game? It's like a single player offline experience. Like, I don't... Competitive strategy, right? You want to get the fastest time. Part of my love of this game is just how much you just experiment with random shit. And it's like, what am I going to sell a tape together today? Okay, there's a moon over here. This one's actually really close. This could be a good starting point for us to fashion, fast, uh, fashion a ship and get over. I think maybe we start on this platform and we work our way up to the moon. What's going on with the moons? Take on a construct. I don't think this is a high level one. Yeah, this is just a construct too. We're just starting with bosses today. <laughs> We've no fear anymore. To be honest, I think after the Lionels, I think we can take on quite a bit. That's probably the hardest thing we've done. Outside of day one. Here we go. Here we go. Easy boss. Fear nothing but toe stubs. <laughs> that probably is my biggest fear. Yeah, actually, let, 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 let's be real here. Most dangerous enemy. Ah, uh, this is like Zonai Tech. If I put this on like one of my Zonai swords, I think it will do good. It, is there any benefit to putting this shit on a shield? I don't know if there is. No, there's not. That's a shame. Just parry damage. Yeah, but like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use parry damage at all, like I'm really not. If this one already has like a soldier construct four horn, but I think maybe if I delete destroy that it might be better. No, uh, th this one Yeah, I can destroy this one. Shock emitter bat. This one has durability up. Okay, let's try it on this. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna destroy it. No, it seems crazy, but this is a good durability one. <laughs> now it does, I think, slightly less damage. Okay, well, you live and learn. You live and learn. <laughs> That's all right. Another old map acquired. Oh, it's actually near, like, locations we can actually get, though. Maybe we give that a look. We need to do another, like, underground expedition stream. I really want to get back to Koga and see what he's been up to. Yeah, but first things first, we're going to the moon. There's been this, uh, several of these dotted around the map, and I just want to see what they do. Ew. 
is like so many batteries. <laughs> Actually, a stupid amount of batteries. Let's just put even more of them on. I mean, this, this will get us to the labyrinth. Uh, this will get us to the moon. Pop them all on. Look at this contraption. This is really cool. Battery heavy, it seems. A bit slow. But it'll do the job. We can explore these islands and then we'll make our way back to the labyrinth. There's a second moon over there. How many moons are there? Be careful with how I... <laughs> Jesus. Careful how I angle it just so I don't, like, crash too badly. <laughs> This is so many moons. I don't know if there's a way to drain the water here, too. It just seems to be an ordinary pond. Yeah, we'll leave, we'll leave our car just parked here a while. Actually, here, do you guys want to see what is apparently the most efficient way to travel in this game? Uh, I, I, I saw someone post this on, like, Twitter. I, I, be I believe Uncle Dane posted, like, something that's similar to this. Uh, this is, like, apparently the vehicle to make, and it's, it's really simple. It is simply two fans and a steering wheel. Sellotape together. Watch this, right? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Okay, it's it's not supposed to work like that. It's not supposed to... <laughs> Okay, let's try it again. Yeah, it's so efficient, you know, the best way to get around the map. Immediately almost dies. <laughs> Okay, yeah, it can be a little floaty, but this is the idea, see? <laughs> it's a little dangerous landing, as you might be able to tell. Stabilizer might help. I mean, maybe, but like, where do you even fasten the stabilizer to? I believe there is a more efficient design um, that I've just yet to try and make. We will probably try and make it at some point. Uh, I've been using that to explore the underground just a little bit. It makes it significantly easier to just traverse it. You can like pop a light in it too. <laughs> oh, straight up just the stakes. Get them, okay. That is a new one, so we can like fasten things better. Um, do I like destroy this? Not sure what I do with the moon. It does look a bit like the Death Star, doesn't it? Let's activate the shrine anyway. This might have some advice for us. How fast can you do the Kessel run? 
can't ent exactly remember what that means. Fake Star Wars fan. Yeah, I mean... Can I grab it? Can't grab the moon. How am I supposed to get inside this? It's just here. Okay, well... Got a saying. And these parts... When in doubt, rock it. Get one of these, and we can get a better vantage point. Okay, there is a way inside. It's completely hollow, right. Here's the stone. I change which way the... Oh my god. Oh, okay, so I've got to I've got to fashion the way home, I think. Hence the spring mechanism. Sure? There's something below us, too. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get in there, though. There's a layer there, so maybe if I position the hole so it's, like, on the border? So, like, here. So we have this here, right? So I just go, like, eh. Maybe I can just slip in. There we go. Oh, this is exactly what we're looking for still, too. We might, So we might be able to upgrade Yonobo. Eventually. I want to check out the other moons just in case they have more of those. They're such a good reward. Like... It's kind of hard, well, I, I say that, it's kind of hard to gauge just how well tulin has been doing. Since we got the power up for him, but I mean, I, it's probably better. It's probably better, like, I, I trust its advice. <laughs> Install a DPS meter. <laughs> Absolutely what's missing here. Okay, this is... Probably going to hurt a little. Get this positioned. I'm hoping this works. Oh, that was... that was fine! We got it! <laughs> oh, jeez. Just barely worked out. Alright. He started to turn into Goofy. <laughs> You can tell the stakes are serious. <laughs> we do have more shrines to go back and visit too, just for like progress towards higher containers as ever. We will go and do that. As we go. Uh but we're just gonna explore these islands first. See what we can get. Situations like this is where I'm glad that recall exists. I could have just done that, couldn't I? 
Oh, of course I could have. And then it would have just like slowly rolled back along the surface. Yeah, I'm I'm so stupid. I'm forgetting like half the power-ups exist. I, well, I can make a long stick and like solid type a rocket to my shield. That's it. That's all that my brain like processes. Because recall even pauses time when you activate it. So like, yeah, it's it's amazing in scenarios like this. I'm just stupid. This one is incredibly high up. I don't know if I'm supposed to reach it from here. I might be able to. It seems like with the waterfalls that you're supposed to get the Zora armor. That's what I'm thinking. If you send the lines, scatter these. Uh, but that bit actually is off our current mapped area, so we will actually leave it just because of that. Yeah, we'll go we'll go explore this bit next. There is an inconspicuous boss arena just hovering here as well. Uh, yeah, we'll go we'll go back the uh, the other direction. Let's continue on our merry way. There's a second moon up there. Let's see if we can fly to it with our goofy contraption. I've got a bit more Zonite as well. I can also just drop these parrots if I want. Let's go. Off on an adventure. You can just use like the thing to recharge the battery this time. Yeah, like, like, like th th this device is just fantastic, just for like getting places quickly and easily. It's relatively safe. You are you are a little at the mercy of the winds. Here's moon number two. Okay, do I even need to use a battery here? I think I can just jump. I, think I can just jump it. We'll make it to the moon in one go, but we'll make it to the base islands here so we can make our way up. It's all right with me. Another flying machine lost to the world below. <laughs> I, think, I think the big battery though is more valuable. Oh, hold on to. Yeah, it's one of these here. What's this for? Rex, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Hope you're having fun playing the game, too. Okay, this is now in operation? The sky mine. Oh, we gotta get up to that rock, like, right up there. The glowing one, too. Uh, there's a capsule machine over here for us, too. And have a fine and dandy time exploring the heavens, as you do. The only the, the only part I can think of that I'm missing is the one that's like a stationary platform. Ah, perfect, there it is. <laughs> Neat. Yeah, there's one more thing in it, so we'll just uh, put five more in. Might have just been more time bombs, that's okay. Yep, we have that marked off. 
We have some stones. Those ones can be handy because now we can kind of make like an orbital relay. I've got an idea for design that like needs those. We finally have access to them. Yeah, let's activate the shrine too and see what it wants. Basically what I want to do is just, it's a simple enough design. It's literally just a hover stone and you use the heads that always like turn towards people. And then you just sellotape cannons on top of those. And because it's on a hover stone, it actually doesn't fall and can like line up better. I think you can use it to beat like any boss. Okay, it's up there. Yeah. Do I want to send this up to the heavens? No, probably not. This is quite a steep climb for this one. Need to go even higher though. Up down here. What was that? Oh god. <laughs> See the game has given us some rockets once again. There is no meta today. We're making an auto cannon fighter played in Zelda. But listen, look, look that just sounds fun. <laughs> like, we're just trying out random shit and getting it to work. Stationary blocks seems really important for it. Yeah, I can launch myself up with the platform again. I just want this radish. Make it a Metal Gear the Beat Ganondorf. Exactly. Got like we want like engineering bullshittery. Defeat Matt Mercer. <laughs> Take him out. Can I just ascend up. Come on. Very specific spot. I'll, uh, I'll take one of these for later myself. And use this. Take one for later. I see so many, like, blocks just on all of these platforms. And where, where is the next ledge? It's just the moon and the island there. I think it is. Okay, I... <laughs> I foresee the issue. I mean, the thing, we could just, we could just use this, honestly, to get the rest of the way. I was gonna have to use, like, a rocket or something anyway to get it out of the way, but... I mean, th th this just makes sense, doesn't it? There he goes. Oh god, we need to get a block inside the moon, do we? I think so. I can activate. <laughs> Did we figure out if we could cheese this with just a bomb? I don't think we can. Let's 
see. You can launch a block from there. Now we'll just quickly make a pit stop here. Give me one second, gang. Sorry about that, gang. Take a thing or two. No, you're good. You're good. Don't panic. Everything's good. Just have to check something. Streamer dies live on Twitch. <laughs> Finally, some quality content. We're all good. Let's harvest the stone. Desperately need resources as well. Um, I have something for you later. We're a bit we're a bit low on the resource count at the moment, though. Anything and everything we can get right now is going to be very valuable. Okay, this needs to just go directly down. I just hope this makes it. Well, I, I actually wait. I, I need to activate the moon first. I should do that. You know, let's just chance it. Just pop it down. Let's find out if it makes it home. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, we'll park that there. The durable rock? I'd say the least. They give you a lot of boulders just to try and get one inside the moon here. <laughs> oh. Okay, well that that one's not making it. Yeah, let's uh try line it up. Appreciate when the game just gives you like a little catapult like this. Okay, that's probably not making it. Why not a bridge? I don't think you're gonna be able to make a bridge that high. I think it is a little too far. There we go. Long stick time. <laughs> Block acquired. Got a birdie. There was like a Brat in the Wild one where you have to play golf or something like that. I imagine it's gonna be back in this game. Um, just because even with the systems, it makes sense, you know. Oh, what is happening?
What actually is happening? Can't stop it now. Um, I have to ascend to get out. Seems a little dangerous, don't it? Does anyone see the hole? I have no idea where it is. Yeah, let's, um... I get a vantage point. Oh, good lord. There we go. <sighs> Zonite shin guards. Shin guards forge of Zonite. Wearing them awakens the magic of the creators, improving efficiency of Zonite devices. Oh, it's like more battery power. Okay, that's an interesting one. Four armor on a default um, piece of leg wear is actually pretty good too. Decent amount. Okay, we can catapult ourselves. Actually, we don't need to now, do we? The stone's already back down. There we go. Yeah, so it seems that the moons have, like, really powerful treasures in them, doesn't it? We want to try and get them all. Play football now. <laughs> we can potentially just ride our flying machine like like a bit longer now. I, I reckon if we get them all, it'll be quite a boost. Got five batteries now to my name. So it's like a little more power. So you can see them there. Picked up an extra one since yesterday. Brian, thank you. Thank you for the kind words. Thanks, man. You finished the Master Koga quest. No, I've, I've got to go back to Underground to get him. We'll probably do that today. We're like exploring this area a little bit. And I want to like get all the shrines in that too. They're good for staying alive and also like our four bows we have now that like get extra power. It's just really valuable. You gonna get any other sage today? Maybe. We're gonna we're gonna start with uh, like a big old explore. We did so much yesterday that it's nice to have like a bit of a calmer day between, you know. It is nice to have like those little calm moments and like just explore a little while. Okay, we still need to make it to the labyrinth here. There's the inconspicuous boss platform. <laughs> Something else there too. Well, this looks like a job for a flying machine. I have, I have this one here, which was actually pretty good. I think I'm gonna make that one again. I can take out all the parts. Steering wheel, battery, battery. Okay, and behold. That's so cool that you can just do that. Yeah, and I'll put on my new pants as well. It's weird having like the power icon to it, isn't it? Well, not much actually in the way of pants, are they? <laughs> Uh, let's set off the labyrinth next. 
There we go. It's a nice, comfy ride. Can even afford to run out of power for a little while here. Because it will just fly on its own. Thought I had so much fun. <laughs> It really seems it, doesn't it? I can't I can't tell how much drain there is. It's kinda of hard to measure, isn't it? What I can do is if I just cease the controls ammo. So you can recharge your battery while you're on it, see? I guess it's like 20% less train. There's definitely a little less. Oh. oh. So much for our vehicle. <laughs> it got us most of the way, though. You know, so it's fine. Pretty much here. Might be able to reach that platform there afterwards. We can do the inconspicuous boss. Oh, this is another low gravity one. I'm guessing they all must be like this then, yeah. If, if like this one's in the sky too, and I'm guessing the third labyrinth has this as well. Seems it. Okay, let's clear the shrine real quick. Man's just skipping a maze. I do have more rockets this time, so I could just try and make my way through. Courage to jump. The low gravity shrine. We got our moonwalk. I think I see what it wants us to do. Like, we have to, like, take the jumps. Welcome to, like, our Mario Kart 8 course that we want to test. Just want to get, like, some player feedback on this one. I'm guessing this will be the bonus part? Friend. Should be a chest somewhere. Yeah, there, there it is. Stop off here. Yep. These ones are always fun. Durability up Mighty Zonite Shield. That's actually amazing. I'm gonna have, like, no actual metal shields left at this point. But, like, I think that's okay with me. These are just so much better. They don't conduct lightning, they have extra boosts. It's on high tech. More efficiently uses everything that's on it. And, you know, we have Hudson to help us too. Pretty powerful. A Mario Kart just ramp here. <laughs> What a fun little shrine. And I'm dead. Okay. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, you're kidding me. Why would they do that?
That just seems unnecessary. Why start you so far back? Yeah, I can go faster if I press forward. That must have been the problem. More speed. Make our way on back again. Wait, it gave me, like, an additional car? Oh, Jesus, Link, what are you, where are you going with this? <laughs> we can go the other way. The other way just seems infinitely more treacherous, which is bomb barrels here for some reason. Oh, they do have a pit stop here with the rockets. They give you a lot of them, too. Which, well, you know what that means. Hang on. Let me just, uh, put one away for later. Just use two for here. You know, just use, just use them all. There's no such thing as too much power. <laughs> Going back to the moons. We just found. Take us to the end. <laughs> doesn't make that much of a difference after a certain point. It really doesn't. I think like two rockets is like the, the max you ever need. That was fun. I like those shrines. Top Gear looking wild. It's Top Gear of the Wild. Game. It's constructing our own cars now. Shrines are so much better than in Breath of the Wild. They really are. Like, there's so much fun. Everyone has this, like, self-contained little puzzle. Like, I know they had that in Breath of the Wild, but there's just- the, the systems are so much more fun here. Love it. Okay, four terminals are hidden in the maze, activate them all. So this is the same as before. Just a new labyrinth layout. Are we gonna get another piece of Ganon's armor for this as well? It's kind of a shit prize, just because you can't upgrade it. It gets so outclassed by everything else you find. But yeah, th th this seems to be the same kind of layout. You can track it. So we can see them on the map. Right, I can already see the way that one on the right. Okay, let's start making our way. We're not as scared of it anymore. Because we know how the, labyr the labyrinth works. Immediately gotten lost. I need to drop down here. So it always gives you gusts of wind. We know the rules of it now. Yeah, like below a certain bit of it. Okay, that's one. 
Need to get to the corner. Come on. Come on, Link. Struggling a little bit. It's the pants. Wrong trousers. Okay, I gotta go all the way around here. It's basically stare at the mini map, the shrine. Nice little blip. There we go. Yeah, these are fun. Like, I, I the lot, the first one I did these we did was very surreal. And that I feel feel like now I kind of just know the ropes a bit. They're still like really different kind of puzzles, aren't they? There's only three of them, too. The main challenge is actually getting to the above labyrinth, just because it takes so long. <laughs> you gotta, like, commute. Like, Link has identified where there might be, like, a blessing. However, he has to, like, circumvent the London Underground to be able to obtain it. Kind of how it feels. What an absolute nightmare in of itself. No, that's the bottom of the maze. Don't you can't go down there. In through here. What am I looking for? Oh, is this treasure here? Yep. You went down the wrong passage somewhere. Soldier four Reaper. Jesus. Get rid of the shock emitter bat. That, that that just seems that seems pretty good. It's a one-handed one too. Jesus Christ. We've so much kit. The LC is just Link slowly fusing a subway together between the major villages and the depths. Uh, like, Link just becomes like an engineer for the DLC. He's like actually just an architect now. That's it. Like, after my latest adventure, you know, it's all out of the picture. I thought I'd just re go back to college and, you know, apply myself. Spirit Tracks. I mean, Spirit Tracks has that to a degree. He's just a train conductor. Not quite the same. Link builds the London Underground, the game. I know for, like, the original concepts for uh, Breath of the Wild, they had a more futuristic style that they want to do. It's in the art books and that. Like, they actually go into it there. I reckon some of that has actually rubbed off on Tears of the Kingdom in particular. The comparisons are definitely there with the technology. Uh, I need to get around. Like, there was like a sci-fi one. I think he's even got a robot hand or like, a, he's got like a biker outfit in like some of the concept art. Some wild stuff for what they actually considered. Like, nothing's really off limits. Yeah, some of those, like, sci-fi-ish concepts are definitely here. 
Like you can just feel them. Around here. Kinda this way. Zelda games keep coming out, they're bound to get crazier and crazier. But the thing is, like, because we're not gonna get another one now until, like, 2029 or something. So, uh, it, it's mad, because like, it really is a series where, like, it takes a long time between installments. It will probably be another six years. Like, the mainline Zelda games since 2011 are Skyward Sword, Breath of the Wild, and this. That's it. Before that, it was like Twilight Princess would have been like... I would actually know there was Link Between Worlds as well. There was Link Between Worlds that did crop in. Did sneak up in there. Awakening. That was a remake. That was a remake. So it's not it's not the same caliber as like a brand new one. Link Between Worlds is the one where it's like it's kinda new. Oh! Oh, we're just being jettisoned out of the maze now. Cool. Sure. It's absolutely a Korok up here somewhere. But I can't be arsed to find him. Okay, it's time to dive on into hell again. Dive all the way down. The main worry with this is the landing. The landing's a bit rough to get because you're in the dark and there's not much in the way of light. I know I kind of panicked last time I did this. Don't accelerate too much, just take your time. <laughs> Do not stub our toe. Jesus, like that's a tight opening too. I don't like that at all. Like, I can't tell how far above this I am. There's so little light. Like, I, I hate diving into these. <laughs> it's terrifying. I, I imagine we're gonna have to fight another construct boss too. Now that we're here. It's on I charge. Right, I think we we have our armor that we want. I kinda wanna keep Majora's mask equipped just because it's cool. Isn't it? I don't think I wanna change that. Even if it's not the best armor-wise. It's just the fact that we have it. Okay. Make quick work of them. It's 
not him. He's in his shoulder. Where'd you go? Found his arm. Genovo, get out of the way. Uh, what would be good here? What do we want? I mean, we could try the, the spear. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Just upset in his cube. Ha, you won't be able to move as cleanly. He keeps shuffling. <laughs> he keeps moving. Pick him apart. Uh, he just he just lost too much structural integrity. And he's dead. It's a good spear. It's just a shitload of stuff. <laughs> okay, we gotta we gotta pop this on something. Okay, this one this one is quite weak with its fused material in relation to what it could be for a rank three, I think. Let's fuse this. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's just a lot cooler, too. That's a, that's a good feeling. Uh, here's like Ganon's jacket that we found down here too. Oh, you're you're gonna have that now. My name is the ruler of dragons. I commend your achievement and offer a fitting reward. Amarid and Utterworld, the evil hidden away since days of old. Take it now. Cannon stinky socks. Oh, he's never washed these. This is terrible. God, he really was evil. How could someone live like this? Evil spirit armor. Inspired by a malevolent entity, it's a rather rare find. Okay, we can pop on glow armor. The level 2 effect for this is Shine and Step. It's basically a means of retracing where you've been in the dark. Like, every now and then you'll see it. It leaves like a particle effect, see? It's cool. It's a good way of just retracing where you've been, and it seems to linger for quite a while. Still want to toss these out, even if you're using it, though. Uh, where is the way out? Yeah. That was normally a door or something. Came from there. Must be over here. Up this way? There's normally a few tools or something like that in here, too. I'll try and grab them. So many postals. 
the ladder here. Another ladder. I'm worried I'm gonna miss like a load of loot or something that's in here. Hey, yeah, here's a chest. There was good shit in the last labyrinth when we cleared it. Even stuff like that is good. Like three of them is another 20 bits towards a battery. can you spend the souls on? You can spend them on, like, bombs, uh, like, gloom resistant stuff. You can get, like, dark link armor. It's, like, been the coolest thing that we've seen so far. Like this. Yeah, 58 power blade. Jesus Christ, game. I don't even know what I toss at this point. Like, I have so many tools. Maybe this. I've used this a bit. We have so much just new equipment. Like, it's absurd. How much is going on here. And there should be, like, a seed or something here for me to get. There we go. Oh, this is in, like, a completely self-contained bit, isn't it? I guess so, because it's, like, surrounded by water on all sides. It's kind of just its own little thing. But this one, this one doesn't connect with the rest of the world. Look at that, it's just eerie. It's just water. Oh, there's a chest down here. <laughs> sure. Uh, what, uh, what piece of equipment am I gonna leave this time? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> The weakest bow is now, like, 34. Actually, stupid the amount of kit we have. We just jump up the entire wall with my stamina. Come a long way. We still have a load of cooking resources in that, too. Don't forget. Hit for days. Here's another chest. What are you gonna give me here? <laughs> yeah, extra durability up 42 damage on Ice Spear. Um, I, I don't even know if I toss anything for this. Maybe the Zelda hammer? I haven't even used this. I haven't even used it once. But it's like the weakest thing. <laughs> Get rid of one of the magic rods. Okay, yeah, we'll we'll, we'll make a Zelda hammer later and try it out. It's like a piece of Zelda on a royal sword. And it's like already stupidly strong and like we're getting like even more weaponry. Leave a rod. No, the, the rods are invaluable. The, the rods are like the best weapon in the game. Absolutely not. We hold on to them forever. Okay, that was crazy. So like we, we got so much just kit out of that this time. Uh, let's do a little shrine run. And we can get some more pieces of heart. And then we could make a move to a new area. I can try to get down to the desert, maybe. Actually, I want to get the Koga. I want to get the Koga and see what he's been up to. Go underground again. You have to cook a radish at some point. You say that in like, such a threatening way. Like, you don't have a choice. You have to cook this vegetable. No! No! 
There's got to be another way. Precise strike. Oh, it's like a golf shrine. I haven't had one of these in a while. Wow, I really did it. That didn't go high enough. Here we go. I think I've already worked out the solution. Yeah, not. Yeah, that 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 works too. Can you just walk into the hole? I think you can. What we're gonna do is we extend it on this. So we get enough lift. Ah, oh, they- no, it's precisely calculated. Precisely calculated so it's not far enough. Ah, there's a second hole over here, too. <laughs> Have to play this out, put one properly. You have no choice. <laughs> oh, it's got a first try. Did it. Momentum's been stopped. Get, get a nice chip in there. Just slightly too high. want that ball anyway. A little lower. It should be good. There we go. Oh, that's really flimsy. Huh. Has to stay in there. Yeah, but what if? Okay, I think this one's close enough. I got. Oh, it's just off. It's just off. It's so... But wait, hang on. If I take the box from the other one... <laughs> no, we'll, we'll, we'll try solve it. It's gotta stay in.
little, little less power. Oh, that's just annoying. <laughs> I can recall it a little bit to fine tune it, yeah. Okay, well that, I mean that one wasn't going in anyway. Here. Stay in. Okay, we're good. Big whack has triumphed. Now I need to see if I can, like, daisy chain some of the other bits together. Like, just solve the other one. Another dura max durability one, like... I have, so, I have so much. This is all brand new. I've not used any of this. Maybe I do actually get rid of one of the rods. Maybe I get rid of this. Just because it's a gloom tall one. I think I do. That feels wrong. It's a 72 damage sword. I need those ice rods. Like the the ice rods are so good. That's brand new condition, but it's a gloom one. It's a gloom one, so I think we can get one that's just as strong, but without gloom. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that. Oh, wait, how was that? I didn't mean to rewind this. <laughs> yeah, we'll get it back now. Not too much power, because it'll be jettisoned off the edge. <laughs> the fact they have the ladder there suggests to me that you're supposed to just run after it. I think that's all I do. I think I just get it across and then I just run. No, you can't make that. Okay. I thought about it. Didn't think about this. Let me just... Let me just walk on the golf course real quick. Oh, somehow it's just gotten in of its own accord. Okay. Never mind. Look, we had it anyway, right? We had it anyway. Didn't even need the cheat. We just did it for some reason anyway. Hey, we're good. Just having the uh, the routine PC troubles for some reason. I don't know why it's been doing this more. 
Yeah, we're back. We're back. Sorry about that. But go quick, then it still catches it, and it's like, it doesn't, Twitch is not like, he's gone offline forever. And it like, lets you actually reconnect. Just gotta go quick. Hang on, let me just, uh, yeah, I'll quickly fix this too. That's in sync. Let me just get it better in sync. There we go. BC's just having some trouble. Yep. Thanks for bearing with me there, gang. Need to hold an election for a new RT. <laughs> who's even gonna be, like, competing? That's the real question. Like, who's gonna replace? How do we even do that? It's probably just gonna- like, it's gonna be Mareep, maybe Hudson. That's it. <laughs> it's just like a cardboard cutout, an inanimate sheep, and me. That's it. That's all you need. It'd be a hotly contested debate, like uh, a debate, but the the sheep would probably win the election cycle. Be our new overlord. VTuber RT is coming for your job. I'll just be replaced by like AI version of me. Sounds about right. I for one welcome our sheepy overlord. Yeah, that's fair. President has other obligations. You wouldn't have time. It's it's tough life being a cardboard cutout, you know. Okay, what do I gotta do? There is a ball. Is this Jenga? <laughs> it actually is Jenga. Okay. Alright, I'm, I'm all for it. Gotta get enough blocks so we can get to the electricity generator. I just want to knock it all over, but I shouldn't. That looks secure. Alright, and then... Oh, there's a chest hidden in here. <laughs> okay, they thought about that. <laughs> oh, the chest is gone now! Come on, game! I didn't expect it to give away like that. There's nothing that really indicates it, is there? Alright. There goes the chest again. It must have been on one of the platforms. Just, I kinda just wanna knock it all over. You go, uh, it's very secure. Jenga tower is secure. That sends that out there? 
Oh, it's to secure the ball, I think. Okay. Yeah. That... Oh no, I'm going to miss the elevator. Unless I use a cheeky power. Come on. Game? Good. Yeah, let me let me rebuild the blocks. A bit smarter. Okay, we're on. Now I can just calmly and surely. Oh, you can't take that block. <laughs> oh, the tower. The tower. <laughs> and it resets the entire thing. Can you do it? Get it without the electricity. Absolutely. Oh, you absolutely can. Okay, hang on. Just catch it. Jenga shrine complete. Just want to see the world burn. Doesn't even collapse right. Oh wait, hang on. For some reason, it's really staying a. F I didn't want it that much. Just leave it. Yeah, it's it's just another opal. Like it's just another opal. It's always an opal. Like you really don't need to worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. Zelda was in that chest. L listen, if she was in there, right? She wasn't. She wasn't doing too well anyway. Let's be real here. It wasn't long for the world. Does President Hudson cutouts in there? Okay, we got a few more shrines to check off. I'm gonna get at least two more heart containers from this, and then we, we can go to a new area. Infinity stones were in that chest. That, that strictly not. We've been finding the infinity stones elsewhere. Rotational brilliance. I just jump on this. No, can't. Behold. Puzzle has been solved. Um, hang on. Behold. <laughs> Thank you. 
You can do so much with recall. It's actually great. Ain't stupid if it works, it's true. It really isn't. Okay, we need to fashion a vessel to get this across the pond. Let's just... Sellotape these. Behold my craft. Get this in the water. Look at us go. Yeah, I don't want to pick that up. <laughs> I could just I could just move the fan. Hang on. How do you feel like the namesake of the shrine, like, Flotational Brilliance is living up to it, currently? Brilliance. Most complicated puzzle yet. Is it working? <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. Another magic scepter. I I don't have space. Okay, I can get a new one here. Get a new one like that. This is a two-handed one. God, that looks so goofy. We'll try it. That he wouldn't drop it? That's another, that's another, like, magic rod type weapon, so it's fine. I'm okay swapping it. It's just, like, refresh your ability. I need at least, I, I want to keep at least, like, two of those on my person at any one point in time. Just in case something goes wrong. Okay, uh, two more shrines to check off. Oh, we can do the inconspicuous, like, boss arena that's in the sky, too. We can see what's happening there. See who's hanging out. It's probably, like, another construct or something. Oh, there's pirate ships off the coast here. I didn't see them before. Well, there's gotta be something out there. Okay, hang on. We'll <laughs> go over to them in a moment. This is the rocket only playthrough. I feel like we're close to that already. Okay, this is turbine power. What are we what are, what are we doing, gang? <laughs> Stick that on. Uh, need something to link the electricity? Do I have like a pipe or anything? There's a plate. What's the metal plate? I don't see it. Oh, that's it there. Okay. You guys think, like, I've, like, kicked your dog and, like, just jettisoned it into the atmosphere if I don't see a necessary component of the puzzle in, like, the first three seconds.
Like, well, he actually shot my grandmother. So, you know, I, I hate this man with a dying passion now. <laughs> is it how it feels sometimes? Okay, well, we still haven't solved this. Uh, there's, there's more stuff up here. Uh, let's pop this here. Okay, take the power off for a moment. Had a little bit of trouble. They even just give it back to you here. It's like, we understand what went wrong. Like, just don't, just don't worry about it. system isn't going to stop us now. Ocean Nightmare Machine. <laughs> I want to make a contraption where it's just like wheels and there's just like cannons and shit stuck to it. Maybe I can do that against this boss, whatever it is. I, I have an idea for a contraption. No, that will probably kill me too, though. I'm thinking about it now, actually. That's probably gonna kill me. Alright, here. I'm gonna- Okay, I'm gonna prototype it here, just so you guys can see it, okay? This is the idea I was thinking. We're gonna- We're gonna do this out so you can see what I have in mind. So, it requires a hoverstone. There's, like, four of these. Three of these. And just cannons. It's a very simple idea. So all of these always look towards your enemy. And so we just have like a wall of cannons. That that's my idea. But basically, whenever there's an enemy, oh god, oh god. Okay, no, that's because there's no one in there's no one in the area. That's why it stopped. The reason for the hover stone is so we can activate it. So observe, okay? Simply strap a rocket to the back. Okay, so you see that poor unsuspecting bat. Okay, it it turned itself offline. That's really unfortunate for the prototype. But I think I can get it working. Hang on. Come on! Take aim! <laughs> Take it! Yeah, I need to get a picture of you as well, potentially. Monster collector boy might want it. I'm trying to do that too. Yeah, it's not quite working the way it should, but the concept is there. 
It's a work in progress. Set that as a favorite. Okay, we'll, we'll figure that out. It's a work in progress. I want to get to the pirate ship. I think the fastest way is to go here or something. Concept is good, Dan. Thank you. Thank you. It is good, isn't it? The idea is you just launch at the enemy, and then the, like, the cannons just start, like, attacking them. Gonna need more cannons. Absolutely the problem. Thunder is not even a problem for us at the moment because we have so damn many options. <laughs> Stuff that doesn't conduct electricity. There you go. Try with beams. I actually don't have beams unlocked yet. I'm not find a capsule machine for that one. Yeah, it seems what's going on with the pirate ship. You flip it so it shoots down and you stand safely above it. That's actually not a bad idea. Maybe we can maybe we could rework the concept. Not not even maybe. We we absolutely can. <laughs> Oh, there's a lot of explosives on this ship. Oh my god, you hit pretty hard. Okay, armor up. Oh, good lord. Get away from him. Get away, get away, get away! <laughs> He's a danger unto himself! <sighs> oh, wait, I need, I need a picture as well, potentially, for the monster quest guy. And smile for the camera. That, that, that weapon is just going to be absolutely destroyed. I'm more worried about the explosive drums. The ship doesn't blow up or anything if none of these go off, does it? But this is safe for me to do. I don't know why, it just seems like something that might happen. I gotta move. A steel bow. I literally don't have space for it. And I need something that's not conducting electricity. Only a, only a paltry 42 damage bow. Gotta visit Hester. Yeah, I really need to... Hang on, wait, wait, I got... Let me take your picture. Just in case the guy wants it. That one sword. Okay, hang on, I got an idea though. Hey, buddy! This is for you! Mm. 
He, has, he doesn't know. He doesn't know. He hasn't seen it. <laughs> Need to get some battery power. Okay, there's one other ship. Oh, Jesus, that was scary. Good man, Tulin. <laughs> just charge this up and, like, just snipe him. Oh, that really hurt! caught in the rafters. These guys are so weak. I feel like they're supposed to have more presence than they do. Yeah, wait. I, I need to get a picture of you. Does that count? <laughs> what a good picture. Okay, you drop this. <laughs> Just messing with him from here. Let me just pass it back to you. It's just a game of tennis at this point. Oh, why isn't the boulder working? I thought I had him with this. What if I try another boulder? <laughs> oh, he's dead. safely take over the ship from here. Updated the Gatterin Pirates? Apparently I had a quest for that. If you did every last one of the monsters sl st stay in at North Akala Beach, return to East Akala Stable, and I oh, you know the monsters are gone now. Oh, okay, yeah, someone was upset that these guys were here. That was it. Pirates defeat it. Let's see what materials we got. I think because they died to the lightning, like, any parts off of them are gonna be, like, scattered to the wind. Oh, I don't like those drums. It just makes- it makes me nervous when I'm standing near stuff like that. I know there's, like, nothing here, but... I feel like I should move. Oh, that's a cannon, that's not a rocket. Oh, fine. Up up here. Uh, ending up top? It's only a soldier's bow. A lot of explosives here. Have any treasure on their main ship? I feel like the way to do this might have been to detonate the explosives a little faster. <laughs> What do I even do with this? Do I have anything I can attach it to? I have this. <laughs> Good sword. <laughs> I 
magic boulder. Yeah, I can pop it on the magic rod. Ideal spot for it. Is there any treasure? Why is it not a chest or something? Uh, hey, thank you for 100 bits. Hair to you, I'm at a casino right now. You got sponsored by casinos. I thought you might have some inside info for me. <laughs> Put it all on black. Just trust me. It's gonna work out. I don't, I don't even need that. More, remortgage your home and put that on the table. And then once you win, because of course you will, you just buy your home back and the mortgage is paid for and you have the amount of the mortgage. Just twice as much money instantly. That's all you gotta do. Infinite money glitch. Uh, this castle? No, it's marked on the map. Yep. Got a shrine here. I think this is the last one, and then we can go somewhere new. For legal reasons, this is a joke. Yes, it is. Combat? Wait, really? Really? Like, ha we're almost like a hundred hours in. And you're gonna throw a combat tutorial at me. In this part of the world. I mean, sure. They really want you to know. Uh, I, I wouldn't have known this technique. Uh, here's how you crouch. <laughs> Did you know? As a result of your inexperience. Game, please. We really need you to know how to do this one. <laughs> I've, I, okay, I need a stealth armor. I can't believe the game is chucking this tutorial at us this late in the game. I have too much stuff that makes noise. Yeah, I think I, I think I should be okay from here. Well done. I did want to shoot it with the cannon, but I was worried the game would be like, you failed again. You're really bad at this. Some of that action-packed music kicking in. This, this, this is gameplay. That we are really Legend of Zelda and Tears of the Kingdom. Did you know that some enemies patrol? My god.
so talented. It's important info, especially for you. <laughs> it's so mean. Uh, you in particular need of that shrine, Dan. Here's a sneaky elixir too, so you don't mess up your stealth sequence again. Ah, oh, thanks game, appreciate it. Very rarely you stealth in this game. A lot of times you just kind of want to brute force it. That's ten blessings. Okay, I've got ten blessings. We're gonna go get some heart containers. And I think this might be a good time to show off my brand new house. Which comes equipped with its own fairy shrine. Done a little grinding off camera, gang, so I could uh, invest in some resources, you know, get some of the features. Has a lot of rooms available. I got a nice kitchen, you know, some weapon stands to display my gear. Got a bed so I can be well rested. God, it's good to be home. We finally did it, gang. We have finally spelt fuck in the Legend of Zelda. Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> uh, so the prayer room's a bit of a tricky one to get to because it's literally sideways. You have to start like by climbing the upside down study. Make your way on in. I think I have to stand on the fairy statue to even like get the prayer to work. Um. No, that's- that's just not registering. <laughs> it's unfortunate. Okay, well, I'll, I'll- I'll have to- I'll have to fix the placement of that just a little bit. Look, I- I finally made use of my armor stance, too. I could only reach the first one. <laughs> The ideal home is here. It's beautiful. I was really worried how I'd get the K done, but thankfully they had this handy stair piece that just fit perfectly. This costs 3,000 rupees for this joke. Please appreciate it. I, I had to sell, like, all my supplies. Like, we, we're, we're, like, completely out of valuable gems. Because there's, like, nothing left. I only have the sapphires. <laughs> These say YouTube to be kid-friendly. I'm not gonna fit YouTube in that space. It's sun and done. Um, oh wait, there is another shrine in the town I can go and do. I'll, we'll fix that house at some point, but for now, it's it's glorious. There's the fuck house. I was hoping to gonna get it towards the cliff edge, but it was really hard to do that. Just space-wise, it's like quite far back. I want it to be like the Hollywood sign, but just saying fuck in the horizon. <laughs> A bit too far back, unfortunately. Okay, um... I need to bring this somewhere. This has to go over here or something. Uh, I mean, I can think of one way to do it. It's just... Auto build. Oh, reliable. Apparently, I nicked his battery too. I 
thing is, I don't actually know where the cave entrance is for this. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, it's not even a cave entrance. It's just over here for some reason. Okay, that's perfect. It serves as a handy, like, biplane as well. Look, you can land it in the water. What a gentle landing. Has he made fuck yet? So ask someone in chat. And you can now tell him, yes. My streamer has spelled fuck. You don't need to doubt it anymore. Hashtag my streamer. <laughs> Oh, I'll take that. If I have, I might have enough money for the Rito bow. Uh, the problem is I don't have enough inventory space to actually carry it. Nor do I think I even want to. Like, I already have so many insane weapons here. I think I have enough diamonds for that, though. Unless I sold the diamonds. I might have sold the diamonds. I can't remember. Go visit Hestu. Yeah, I could probably visit Hestu. I need to get, like, just more weapon spaces in general. The arrows take up a bow slot? I... I think they have their own slot. You sold the diamonds? I think I... Look, that house was expensive, right? I think I did. No, I did not. I actually managed to be able to keep the diamonds. My god. I can sell one to try and get some of the money back. Okay, let's, um, get our fairy blessing. Let's go, let's go check where Koga's at and what his deal is. We haven't seen him in forever. I think we can access, like, points that are actually quite close to him now. Can we get a pinned message saying Dan has spelled fuck? <laughs> Important one. Announcement. I'm probably gonna upload a picture of that to Twitter later. Just like the caption, I love Zelda, or something like that. Like, perfect. Okay, even more heart containers. Get two more. Going well. Tag the development studio to it's Hey Nintendo of America. <laughs> I found a no-no word in your latest game. Just tag Reggie. <laughs> Just fucking Reggie. He doesn't even work there anymore. It's like, hey Reggie, my man. <laughs> what do you think? Probably just be blocked. <laughs> I don't want to see this. Ah, oh, God. Okay, so let's find out where your man has gone off the... Wait, I also turn in the Gatherin Pirate quest. Actually, really quick. Just because we, we've actually already done this one. I just forgot to talk to the guy. Estu, I'll get back to Estu, it's fine. Estu's not there. Estu's not there, Estu's already moved. Breaking news, streamer spells fuck in the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. He is now the fucking streamer of all time. The fucking streamer. 
It's like such a proper title with the the. Okay, hey, the pirates have been dealt with. Please pay me compensation. Oh, you're gonna give me pony points. Oh, no. You got any money? No, that, that's a carrot, but... Okay, good job. Alright, you tried. <laughs> okay. Sure. Oh, Kala Ancient Tech Lab is up the hill. I should pro I need to go to the tech labs. We've avoided those so long. We'll get to where Koga is in a minute. There's just like a little like mountain bit that we can explore here too. Check out Ario. All the horse rewards have been so far is just like um like cosmetic stuff outside of the harness. Iron has been the most handy one. Oh, ah. And register another horse. Oh. Yeah, let's go up the hill. Stop by the tech lab. There's another tech lab uh, over in Hatno, but we just haven't been there. Rockets, we don't need horses. Actually, we're very low on rockets. We probably do need the horses. Yeah. Last your way, you're on your own, my man. Ha. Ha. Yeah. Here at Nintendo of America, Mr. Streamer at RT Game has spelled a swear word in your video game. And has exposed my child to such a dastardly world word. Please fix your game and stop him before he corrupts more minds. Yes, that's that's perfect. It's Link, get ready for battle. Oh, the the Yiga clan is just moved in here. Sure? I probably should have checked, like, they, they have their flag, like, all over it, don't they? Probably should have just looked at the door. Like, hang on, something's going on here. It's, it's very heavily signposted. Hey, how's it going? Oh, it's the guy making uniforms again. We get like a second piece of it. Let's take the Yiga armor. We actually get a disguise kit? You wore the whole set, you fit right in with the Yiga clan. That note, I gotta hurry out of here before they get back. He ran, thanks for the save. Yeah, we're, we're missing, I think, like a pair of pants or something like that. Last one... I got the one on the plateau, so the last one must be near the forest somewhere. Okay. That's interesting. Oh. There has been a horrendous cave-in. <laughs> Again, putting the Master Sword to work. Thank you, Zelda, for your sacrifice. There's a chest downstairs, was there? Yeah, there it is. Travel Medallion Prototype! Probably reverse engineered a travel medallion to make this prototype version. Then usable its current state because it's missing some important data. Okay. 
I remember the travel medallion being the thing in the DLC for Breath of the Wild. You could set like a custom teleport location. But because I haven't gone back to Hatno Village at any point in time, it's unusable, I imagine. <laughs> so we need to do that first. Ah, we forgot to go to the ominous boss in the Sky Island, too. Thinking of it here. Careful now, Ario. Anything down here? Oh, there's a fairy fountain. I didn't expect there to be one out here. This one's not on the map. Someone give it to me. Even one will do. Someone please feed me an Endura carrot. Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> that was a handy quest reward, it turns out. We didn't have to get the, the band together or anything for this one. Oh, this is the horse god. They've, they've relocated it. It was you, wasn't it? You're the one who gave me that Endura carrot. So long my stomach has been torturously empty. Thanks to you, I'm at last have the energy to emerge from my bud. You have my thanks. My name is Melania. I'm the god who watches over the horses of this world. Grateful as I am that you fed me my first meal in so long, my appetite still is not satisfied. But please, please don't eat me. Ah, I'm just joshing you. Mm. Can I revive loyal steeds that have died or enhance horses' abilities? They want food. Understood. The gods of horses cannot revive an empty stomach. Generation after generation is repeated that saying. Can I enhance a horse? Can I can I fix what's wrong with Ario? Oh wow, you can straight up just improve them. You make meals. Get extra stamina, so I need to make like vegetable risotto, carrot stews, cream of vegetable soup. So you, God, I, I, okay, this this feels like something that I'm gonna have to check the wiki on more than anything. I get up, Ario, strength. Ario is stronger now. Copious fried greens are required for the next rank. So the conditions, the conditions seem to ramp up as time goes on. But you can get like five star horses. Okay, I mean that's cool. That's cool that you can actually like make them better. I don't think you could do that before. I think that's new. We can make Ario the perfect horse. The lab down? What about the lab? We already did the lab. Come on. Come on. There's a book you forgot. Is it just like lore or something? If it just had lore, that like we're fine. You missed the Yiga set as well. I got the Yiga set. I got the... I, I have the armor. <laughs> yeah, we're good, we're good. Like, don't, 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 don't worry. My, 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 I've, I've done my homework. The assignment has been turned in and completed. 
in the clear. Uh, I can go back to Tarrytown and actually ha see what the statue guy does too. Still getting sidetracked from getting back to Koga, but we will get there. Ah, dear. Yeah, we have, we have a few stops, but we're just gonna chill. You know, like... We'll get around to it all. There's no rush. We got a long boy stream today. I'm gonna see if I can drop off these pictures of monsters for you, man. I think he's gonna set up a little diorama here. Explains why this plot is just empty. I think that plot used to be Link's house. <laughs> but for whatever reason, I guess Hudson just decided to destroy it between games. <laughs> Which is a bit unfortunate. Yeah, I've got I've got a bacoblin. There you go. Take this picture. We can quality blink and we're done. That's why every son chooses Hudson Construction. He didn't pay his rent. <laughs> I thought you got a house in the town before. Oh, look at that. Coblin get. Ooh. Ooh. Got a rule against making that kind of decision. Too much responsibility, not my kind of thing. Okay, we're gonna have to place it. There we go. Found a spot. Look at him go. I mean, this is cute. Can you place it upside down? I'm gonna place one sideways. <laughs> My god, look at this monster. A new amiibo figure, coming soon. This guy loves his monsters. I feel like giving it a hug all of a sudden. And learn, then you won't hate, understand what you fear, and you'll feel great. Does it open mind? Wonders always await. Okay, a monster extract. I'm used to make a number of monstrous meals. Okay, he wants more sculptures. We can make more. Horrible is next. I, I think I have a picture already. We've just kind of anticipated the quest line. Probably gonna end with like a Lionel or something like that. Look at this awful picture! <laughs> it's so terrible. You can barely see him. But that's enough to go off of, so we won't question it. Okay, I'm gonna I gotta place him again. Same as before. <laughs> Can you just be like? <laughs> Yeah, I found the perfect spot. It looks so natural here and so realistic too. It's as if we've stumbled on a monster's lair. Ooh. 
Look at him go. He's just <laughs> falling over. <laughs> okay. Give me, give me, give me a little reward for it. He's offering education on the monster, too. Sneaky monster soup. 30 minutes stealth up. Oh, wow, that's actually insane. This is the monster extract. Okay. Picture of Madison in Gerudo Town. <laughs> Another monster. How about this picture? Okay, so I have a few. Look at this blue chew go. But I think you can get a copy of everything. Look at this guy. I'll have to take a picture of like a boss at some point. I'm gonna put him like where you actually can't see him. Yeah, I've had a nice spot for him. Is this one counting? <laughs> yeah, sure, just work away. <laughs> it's a wall. An actually scary monster. Pop him up here. Look at him go. I don't know if he's gonna give me another reward. I don't know how many monsters I gotta give him. Oh, put the tree in, yes. I think he wants to see a battle talus? Oh, okay, I have to talk to him. I gotta give him the tree, though. Evil tree has been added. Don't fall over. Got a monster in mind. Yeah, Battle Talus is the next one. So he's gonna launch us everything. I wonder... Are you gonna run out of space for this? Like, there's actually a lot of enemies now. Can I fuse them? No, you can't fuse the sculptures. Just stack them. <laughs> like... There's a nice spot for it. <laughs> Determined to stand upright. Perfect use of space. I'll try and get a picture of King Gleok as we go, yeah. Why not? Okay. Um, next stop. Quickly pay a visit to Hestu. Take a picture of Zelda. I don't know if they'll count the dragons as monsters. I get Phantom Ganon, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, Hestu's relocated here. I still don't have enough for a new weapon. Get a bow slop. I think I want another weapon one. I think that's the most important. Like, I already have enough shield slots. I have plenty of bow slots. All those bows are doing 50 now. That's so good. Just so many pieces of heart. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll just wait and see. We are ready to go. Uh, we could try, we could try do this. There might be a good reward for it. Best place to get there is probably just catapult from here. I can try my new cannon battery. How the fuck is the map still not fully unlocked? <laughs> I... I've, like, I've been going, like, in-depth into each area over just, like, completing one, I think. Yeah, I think I can get up to the top of this first. We unlocked enough wind. Uh, yep. I think I can just fly across from here. Might be able to, honestly. It's it's quite far. Higher up, though. We have a fair bit of stamina, too. I think we should be okay. Let's see if I have any stamina dishes. We have that extra wheel. Might be the time to use it. Main issue is if it's a dragon, we have to just get like a nice landing. <laughs> um, food wise, what have I got? Yeah, I've got loads. I don't know if there are multiple King Gliox. No, it's a construct. I'm gonna need, like, a little more anyway, so we can just use some of that. Construct guy just chilling out here. Take a picture. Oh, yeah, I'll get a pi uh, let's get a picture of him. The real reason we're here. It's like I I need to get a sculpture. Yeah, I should probably just be using this or something. Hey, right, let's go. It is yet another one. Oh, he's gone. Uh, can I just do a spin to win? Not if he takes it into the sky. These bosses are just fun. I like them. It's a 
dismantle him. He's really struggling. <laughs> Got, got him. Definitely making the most of the time. <laughs> Not too afraid of him. Here we go. There we go. Easy boss. Now we get like another component too we can use. Stick that on something too. Uh what have I even got? I can I can discard the the construct core two. I mean, sure. Oh, I do have, like, the Iron Mace, actually. Hang on. There we go. It's probably better. There. Another 57 attack power weapon. It's pretty good. <laughs> what do we get for beating them? Another map. I need to go to all these locations because I think the, the the treasure maps in particular are marking like armor and stuff like that Like more notable point of interest Okay, I can I can try and get the Koga then Where where is he? Master Koga he's over here I'm Trying to see where the closest entry point is. It's probably like this one here. Can I even get to him? Because that's going to be water. I don't know if I can. He's in a weird spot. I could try it. Zora's Domain, yeah. Like, it's because, um, so water on the above world means solid wall. Uh, in the underground, usually. That's so why I'm not sure if I can actually reach him, because he's, like, actually under Zora's domain. Uh, but we'll give it a go. You know, it's... we're, we're exploring. Right under the capital. Yeah, so you, you can see this clear, so like, look at Hyrule, right? Water everywhere, and then it's just closed off. So it's really self-contained. I'm tempted to go fight the final boss again. I think we can do it. I know there's like two other stages, but I think we have the kit at this point. But no, we'll save that. We'll do all the champions, because I want to see them too. I want to see them as well. Oh, hello! Crab guy's just down here. I'm actually kind of surprised he's like that near a, a hole down. Oh, he's easy. I'm not even worried about fighting him. Ah, oh, it's a photo op. It is. Like, the Rito boss actually scares me. Uh, this guy, this guy is nothing. This, this, this guy was so simple before. Although the combat arena is a little bit different this time, so maybe it plays differently. Okay, photo op. Get that in. We're just, we're just good to go. Yeah, I'll use this one because 47. Yeah, I'll use this one because it's used already. 
All right, let's take him down. Scourge of the Depths. Okay, and we just hop on. How long can you spin? Oh, he buffs you off now. He's having none of it. He's pissed this time. Those are apparently mines. Cool. Come on, my man. Keep running away from me. There we go. Can we just keep spinning? Does he have anywhere he can go for a phase two? He clung to the ceiling before. I don't know if he does. His leg. <laughs> Let's go for a little climb. Just start hacking. Oh, he hurt me. Can I just shoot him? I can use recall on one them too. But it doesn't really go anywhere. <laughs> Spawning in a weird way. Okay, that, that's a really easy boss. That was not hard. Uh, the other one is horrifying whenever you encounter him. This guy, this guy's not so bad. Uh, how long until the Master Sword is charged? I need to pop this on something. I, I have nothing for it. I probably want to take this. We just sit tight for four minutes. Maybe. Take another bit of battery. Pick up the Traveler's Claymore. Ah, Traveler's Claymore is not that good, though. I feel like this on the Master Sword would just be a stupid amount of power. Yeah, but we would have to wait around a while, so okay, I'll just, I'll just get it. Break down the weapon later and have to know if you want. That's true. Traveler's Claymore would attack up. That. Okay, so that's now a 53 damage hammer.
Jesus. Pretty good. Okay, we need to get the Koga. So, easiest way to do this. Sign our devices. Take out two fans. Take out a steering stick. Uh, auto build. You hold my flying machine. And what we also do is you stick a giant bulb on the front. Gotta quickly hit it before it takes off. Uh, and now you have a handy vehicle for traversing here that lights up the area too. People have been posting about this on Twitter and stuff like that, which is where I saw it. And it just seems like quite a practical way to get around. You want to add a stabilizer? It's a bit funnier without the stabilizer, honestly. It's a bit funnier. I have no above world map for this, so I just kind of got to go. Problem with my design is it keeps pulling up. Which is causing just a few issues. <laughs> oh. God, those are pretty high category enemies too. Oh, the cannon! <laughs> Gotta be careful if I'm not swinging. <laughs> God! Okay, a regular shield, please. A regular shield. Dodge that last swing that knocks him over. I'll just let him get back up again. The gang, the gang is just gonna do a number on him while I like gather some supplies. There we go. Silver Moblin Horn acquired from that's the most valuable kind of Moblin material. Pretty good. And we'll use this up too. Yeah, the flying machine really helps, like, just actually exploring the depths. It's such, like, a practical design. It's cool that people have, like, already devised that and, like, sharing creations and stuff like that. It's one of them I saw. It's like, huh, that seems actually really useful. Just makes it easier, like, getting around. Um, just grab this. There's stone anywhere. There is. Uh, blue bacoblin horn. It is. And stuff. Yeah, there's probably better designs and stuff like that, too. Like, I know people have already revised, like, the bike and that, but, like, it's fine. It'll do the job for now. 
can we could head on our merry way. Our constant battle to steer. The nice thing with the bulb is, see, it li lights up trees and that, so you don't just crash into them. You can somewhat see the direction you are headed. Main problem with my design is it keeps, it always goes up. There's no way to stop it from going up. But I often have to make like an emergency landing. Like, this is my stop. <laughs> At the very least, you get to use the wreckage of the craft to light the floor below. You know, so. It still serves some purpose. Angle's probably too sharp. It absolutely is. It's fine, though. So, it's just a fun way of navigating this place. Like, because it's like, it takes so long to traverse. Uh, it was a ma only a matter of time before people were like, right, here's how you make a car or a plane. to get around it proper. You can just kind of stop whenever you want. Traveler's Spear. We're close to it. It's the next one over. Okay, I'll, I'll see if I can find the bike. I think it crashed over here somewhere. I don't know how long it must take to 100% this game. It depends on what you want to do, honestly. Like, I'm always in the mindset for these games that it's like, you don't have to do everything just to get, like, most enjoyment out of it. I think doing like all the Koroks and that is just a torturous exercise. Like I I don't know why you would. I think it just wouldn't be fun. Doing stuff like shrines and that I think is understandable. And like doing the quests. Was like like yeah, I think I'm gonna sleep at night if like I miss a blue pea or something like that, you know, or if I if I miss a well on my completion progress, I think I'll be okay. You know? <laughs> I think I will survive. Is that another arena for a future boss? Is that what actually signals them? Yeah, it is. Jesus, okay, so there's gonna be one here at some point. I'm amazed just how accessible some of them are. Like, it feels like I'm not even going that far. I need to check. Right, so here's the problem. We need to find a way to get the Koga. I'm guessing... ...that it's gonna be, like, one of these narrow corridors. Turn the bike around. It's gonna be hard the spot is the only thing. Oh. Oh, that was a little e easier than I thought. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this, this this has to be the way to it. Big posts here too. From the Koga's next arena. Huh. 
get the light seed here just to make it nicer for ourselves. Pass that. The water from up above is just falling down here, it seems. <laughs> we haven't been to Zora's Domain yet. I think Zora's Domain is probably going to be the last one I even go to. I kind of want to go see what's happening in the desert. It's cool that we can see some of it. And so there's the tunnels to access it. Get a nice, bright view of it. I think there's a... gate from Zora's Domain as well? Yeah, I can see it there. Okay, so there's just a hole above us in the, in, in the world. Okay, let's get a little bit of height just so we can tool in away. There we go. I don't know exactly what Koga would have been looking for at this mine in particular, because, like, I mean, it's flooded. <laughs> like, there's not much going on. He's, he's just ha hammering away there. Just pillage his supplies real quick. See what we can find. Feel everything around here. Maisie hasn't noticed us. <laughs> Our band. The only known way to enter the depths is through chasms. After the upheaval, many chasms appeared across Hyrule. Navigating the depths proves too, too treacherous. Try leaving and return through a different chasm. Fully conquered the depths, we must find every entrance. Unfortunately, locating chasms is not always straightforward. Rumored, for instance, that a chasm is somehow opened inside a cave. Surely, this is not the only concealed entrance. There may even be holes that do not seem to be chasms at first glance. Take heart. The gloom that leaks from these pits acts as a beacon. Most can be seen from above. Okay, so that's trying to give you, like, a clue. This does not bode well. He's just, like, staying quiet. This Koga's, like, smashing the PC console over here. Hey, how's it going? He's gonna try and steal our hand at this rate. Hey, it's been a while. How long have you been there? You little tried to catch me off guard, did you? You cowardly sneak. Like I said before, my plan has changed. We already mined up everything here there is to mine around here. What you saw was just uh you know. I was killing time. <laughs> well 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 played, Koga. So yeah, you get it. Anyway, I can't believe you followed me to another mine. Persistent little pest. Not over a long awaited reunion, I graciously allowed you to fight me one on one before. Right now you're the last thing on my mind. Because the end is nigh. Oh, he's got a raft. I've got things to do, so let's make this real quick. Yiga clan attack. Okay, bodyguards dealt with. Oh, he's got some vehicles here. Let's go. I said, let's. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh god, we can just use Yunobo for this. Take him out. I'm gonna get you, just you wait, Koga. <laughs> Okay, Yonobo is completely breaking this. Wait, I, hang on, I need a picture for the album. Smile, K Koga. Yeah, do you know Tarrytown? You're gonna look great there. really doesn't stand a chance. Poor man. <laughs> Absolutely put to shame. Once again, you're too late. I've already dug up all the crystallized charges this place had to offer. And there's more. It's got word from my underlings. They've located the man himself. They found the Demon King. Just one more step. One teeny little step until the Yuga Clan's long stand desire comes to fruition. We have more than enough crystallized charges now. There's only one more abandoned mine to ransack. Mm. Time to start the final excavation. The northwestern abandoned mine awaits. That's where I'll use those charges to activate our ultimate weapon. Offer it to the Demon King. And bring the world to its end. Oh, okay. We gotta just go in pursuit of him. We'll get yours. Just you wait. He's going straight up for like a vertical climb. I don't think he's gonna make it. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, the path stretch of a highway ridge that was previously used is no longer a viable route. I recall it being a chasm somewhere that connects directly to the abandoned mine. One other thing before you resume your journey. Yeah, let's activate your friend here. We have enough for another full battery now. Let's try to turn in a few more shards. So, where is he? Oh, that's... I've... I've mapped really close to you. He's like here. Yeah, so we just gotta find a way to access it. How oh, nice of him to leave behind a hundred charges. It, it is very polite, isn't it? Yeah, the bolt boat acquired. Seems really dangerous. Sure. Won't question it. Yeah, it did sound like it's a special entrance. Like, it's not a conventional one. So maybe we can't just access it like by normal means. It might be a self-contained arena or something. If he's hyping it up as the last encounter, it makes sense. Yeah, yeah, set up your shop. Uh, we can buy one of these. And that gives us enough. For another full battery. Pretty good. Anything on top here? <laughs> Is backseating allowed? I can't think of a single scenario where like, I'd want people to backseat. I don't think that's anyone. Yeah, yeah sure. If I do something wrong, I want you to scream at me. You know, like, I I can't think of a world where backseat has like a positive context.
And the stone? We got the stone. Talk to you, man. Okay. Uh, so I gotta get over there. First things first. More battery. Just stop off here again. Especially with this game, there's so many ways to actually do everything. You know, like, I feel like unless I'm asking something specific, then you, know, you don't need to tell me anything. I'll figure it out. I'll flail wildly. I'm happy doing that. That's part of the joy of it, you know? Hey, give me another battery. We have six now. We've almost got a full belt. Doing good on the battery front. Get producing. One more, please. If he asked for help, clearly the long stick has failed. He's like, guys, I tried a long stick and I tried strapping a rocket to it. How the fuck do I solve the puzzle? I don't know what to do. Hydrate check. Game, thank you for the 100 bits. I've, I've got a flask of water here with me, so don't worry. Okay, so yeah, it did sound like it's an entrance through a cave, didn't it? So, maybe we just go to, like, the Rito village? What does it even say in the adventure log? Or maybe a chasm that leads you straight to it. Yeah, so th th they seem pretty clear on this. Chasm's not there, is it? That just might be Koga. Do you have your glasses? I do! I've been better with my glasses lately. I've been better hydrated. I have, I have my eyesight improved. I've had glasses on. I've been sleeping well. I've been remembering meals. Mostly. Been doing well. When are you gonna work out? I've actually I actually have been. I actually have been, um, but I, I might have also done it wrong because I actually injured myself a little. <laughs> Went a little too hard, but it's okay. It's all right. Yeah, let's see if there's a chasm, like, just here. Oh, there's just a treasure chest sitting here, sure. No questions asked, this is just here. Have some arrows. So just, why is there another treasure chest just here? Why is there just arrows? Someone just like left these boxes. Okay, so I feel like we're looking for like a cave entrance in the side of the rock. Like, that's, that's the only thing I can really think of. Look for gloom. Yeah, like gl gloom. There should be gloom to indicate it. But if it's in a cave or something like that, it, it might be a bit harder to spot, you know? I'm gonna look. I don't know. Can I ever fix this bridge? Bridge is just gone forever now. Bit unfortunate. Long stick bridge. Perfect. 
Maybe there's a side quest or something for it. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to find a bit of gloom. I've been up the top of the rock before. I don't think there was anything up there. I feel like it's gonna be on one of these. Or just like a cave in the depths. It's kind of below. Hello there. Oh, have you found it? Oh, you look like you might have. Search the area around Rito Village for a chasm, and lo and behold, I found one. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's super sneaky. There it is. Oh. Really sneaky chasm. Grab some resources. Uh, sure, let's just let's see what Koga's got in store for us. Down we go. Wait, is there one right there? Uh, I, I guess that's kind of under where the Rito Village is. Yeah, it is. Okay. I was about to say, I, I, that seemed a little bit closer. It didn't seem like it lined up perfectly. But it does. They, they did their homework. Oh yeah, it's self-contained arena. Look at that. Okay, at least we don't have to worry about this one being too dark. We've already lit up the entire thing. Apparently Ganon's just gonna be down here, according to Koga. Like, I somehow doubt it. I'd be shocked. Matt Mercer's just chilling here on his way to Critical Role or something. But, oh, okay, alright. Like, behold, the final boss of the underground. That's how it feels. He he's rearing the go. Okay, well, we have our party. Let's give it a shot. Mm. Been waiting for you. It is done. We have enough crystallized char charges at last. Mm. And now, a gift to the Deem King. Mm. Weapon beyond compare. Will be reborn? <laughs> they will go down in infamy. As the day of our ultimate weapons resurrection. And the day the world faced its end. Behold this feat of engineering. Oh, he's actually got something. Oh, it's kind of cute. <laughs> Your blessings, Link. Your debt will prove the Yuga Clan's might. I gotta go take my rightful place. In the darkness below the castle where the Demon King now dwells. That's where the end of all things will begin. It's quite a small mech. Oh, we're locked in. This time I'll bury you. He's just, he's just, he's been playing Overwatch. That's what's going on. He just thinks he's D.Va now. It's, it's an embarrassing display. It only does a quarter. It only did a quarter. 
I don't think we need to nerf this. I don't think it's doing well. I got, yeah, what? Well, well. Ah, it's the same picture, I think. He's not even in that one, but sure. There we go, that's a nicer picture, that's a nicer one. I mean, there's like no point in fighting the mech. You just gotta knock him off. <laughs> the gang is just taking shots at him. Uh, he might he might have a trick up his sleeve. That only did a quarter of damage to. I don't know how I get him. That? There we go. Okay, get him, gang. Take the shot, tool, and don't be shy. I gotta, I gotta just wait for him to do his wombo attack. Actually, I can just start hacking away at him. I pick a pirate's back? No, I can't. It will take a while, but we'll get there. I just fire Yonobo at him. It's just on fire. I was hoping that would work. That'd be a very anticlimactic end. I need him to do his wombo attack. You know? Not even. We'll just beat him down. There we go. Dylan, you wanna just take the shot at him? Ah, uh, you, you waited too long. <laughs> A beautiful weapon. All oh, my work destroyed. You lit- I thought he was gonna say you little shit. <laughs> it could've been your one swear, Nintendo. You're allowed one. Was this close to destroying the world with the Demon King? I think I'm just gonna let this stand, do you? <laughs> oh, he's lost it. I had to bust out my serious moves. A brand new technique I came up with in the deepest darkness of the darkest depths. It will destroy you. Oh no! He's employing our strategy! He knows the meta! Yeah, it works about the same way for us, too. <laughs> so was it supposed to <laughs> Oh, there he goes. Unless he makes, like, a hard 90 degree angle, he's actually gonna die. Like, he's gonna collide with the cave wall. There's a narrow entrance. Oh, well, see you later, Koga. We'll come to you. Please wait a moment. 
If you try out a trespasser, or watch your battle closely. It's unlikely he will appear in another abandoned mine. His manner of departure attests to that. Mine similar to this one can be found under thriving surface settlements and other places of distinction. There appears to be some connection between the surface and the depths. I see you find this equally intriguing. It'd be a good idea for you to explore this connection. One other thing before you resume your journey. Ah, yeah, we get a we get a schematic stone. Sure. Can we get like his mech golem? Can we just get a mech? Got a piece of battery. Another diamond. I'll take it. Yeah, they're just like, hey, there's something weird going on between the two. They look similar. Just letting you know. Okay, give us another stone. Rocket platform. This actually does feel like something I would design. <laughs> That's, that's straight up, like, I just make that. Trying to haphazardly get somewhere. Hey, here, here's one for you to test it out as well. My god, what a creation. Oh, there's stuff up there too. Yeah, let's activate the forge. Set up your shop, friend. I'll use it in a moment, don't worry, I'm just- I'm just activating the shop. 186 of that. I'm saving, like, the- the bulk zonite. Yeah, let's- let's pilfer their supplies, too. <laughs> Need a new uh, box breaking stick. Could do the job. Feel the bananas. I don't, not seeing too many. Every Yuga should keep their glorious purpose kindled in the heart by singing our anthem at least three times a day. Yuga Clan Anthem of the Depths, we clumps of earth. Glory to Koga and the mighty Yuga Clan, our master is the strongest, he's got a secret plan. His fall from sand to darkness did bring him to the depths, but did he waver? Never. He into action left. Yuga Clan then followed. Hearts fiery and true. We'll soon raise up our weapon, revived by stone of blue. In the dark we dwell now, we covert clumps of earth. Soon we'll rise to take Hyrule for everything it's worth. Glory the Koga and the mighty Yuga Clan. The earth itself will tremble. Our ascension is at hand. You can tell they have a lot of fun, you know? It's it's kind of like an after-school club, Giga Clan. They really just enjoy themselves. They're not actually gonna take over the world or anything. That's unlikely, but they, they, they know how to have a good time. Do I not get Koga's mech at all? I, I, was, I was thinking maybe it might be like a special design. I don't know, like, what he, if he's referring to anything else. That was his weapon, wasn't it? I mean, I imagine there's more stuff still down here. A blue stone is what he was talking about, yeah. But this is a blue stone, isn't it? Like, I think that's what he's talking about. Platform is the ultimate weapon. I'll get this big pose, so. Yeah, like, I, I think that's all he was referring to, is just, like, the batteries and stuff like that. I don't know if there's anything else to actually, like, pick up. Also, this mine has been absolutely, like, picked clean. There's, like, nothing here. 
scene around here, maybe. It's the only spot I can think of where there might be some. Oh. Okay, I mean, there's all the treasure spots that are still about the place. There's a whole underground here. There's a lot happening. Check the quest log. Is there anything else in the quest log? I don't think there is. Village attacked by pirates. We've been having trouble there. We've been hearing about that. Oh, yeah. I met... A, there was, like, a great fairy statue that was, like, check on mutter. Which is, like, we know is already, like, the knocked over stone. So they're in trouble. Uh, there was a lady who wanted to see the fossil. Um... Oh, there was something here that looked fun. Hang on. I, I wanted to show this on stream. I remember this. Go over here. Colonel Sanders Goron has a quest. So I thought I'd save that. He's objectively the best Goron. Had a quest down here. Just sitting tight, see? Money is no object. I'll blow through a mountain of rupees for a mountain of exquisite rock. Ripened flint is a true delicacy. May I have any of your ripened flint? I'll pay you a thousand rupees per piece. It looks like normal flint, and you won't know one way or the other until you try eating it. No telling whether or not it's right in Flint until I eat it. Now, you... Yeah, so you can give him a lot. This feels like gambling. Which is why I'm all in. Ooh. The polite way to enjoy it is to roll it silent between the tongue. The tongue. Allowing it to dissolve. Huh? Oh me, oh my. Immediately found some. Authentic ripened flint. Here are your thousand rupees. Amazing. Give him another 20. What have we here? It's ripened flint. I'm just winning today. Oh my god, he gives so much. Okay, well, we have money again. Uh, cool. How much more flint do I have? Just out of, just, just out of curiosity. How much more can I afford to give him? I have 40 more. Oh, me, oh, my. Oh, it's only normal flint. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got lucky. We won twice already. We've got 2,500 rupees now. It covers a lot of the money that, like, was put down on the house. Buy a second fuck house. I do want to redesign the home at some point and make, make it nice and that. I'm a sucker for like any kind of like house design and components in games. We will we will go through it and like make it so it doesn't say fuck at some point. Uh okay. Let's Oh yeah, let's go to the last great fairy. Let's do that actually. And then we're going to go to the mountains north of the desert. And get some more tears of the kingdom, I think. Actually, or or we could check out the rainforest. Maybe we can get back to that Thunder Island. Because we really wanted to see what was up in that, didn't we? That's already map territory, so yeah, we're gonna do that first. Check out the rainforest. 
The band is here, though. The last great fairy is here, too. If we can get this, then we're gonna have, like, maximum tier armor. There the Ziga. Oh, he's up there. I was wondering. I thought he wasn't at this stable before. <laughs> Remember, climbing the stables is such a treacherous thing to do in Breath of the Wild. And now it's just shockingly easy. Hey, Pen, how you doing? He was kidnapped. We heard of the Yiga partner. Gang of lowlifes who worship an evil entity and plot against Princess Zelda. Uh -huh. Now they claim that they've kidnapped her. Or they're not even worried about being found. In fact, they sent a message to the newspaper. We've taken Zelda to the carved out heart of the Tower and Twins. Understandably, Miss Tracy is all worked up over this news. Mm. Oh, okay, there must there must be a hollow. Uh -huh. In the mountain? Okay, we, we can go up we can go up the mountain. We haven't really done that. Easiest way is to actually probably fast travel to that island, isn't it? Which we do have a fast travel point for, yeah. Something crazy going on here too that's on our map. We need we need to check that out. Alright, but um this is more important than saving Zelda. I need my armor. Okay, who we who we looking for for the band? Great fairies in hiding. Beats's drum. Okay, where did he go? Someone heard a drum near Kakariko to the north, where the road meet bends around Bonuro Stand. Okay, that's that's the quest. Let's get going. Fly a plane into the storm. I could probably do that now. The fact that we're a bit braver with our creations means that we could just make something and like kind of fly through it. But I I, I think there is a way to clear the storm. I'd be shocked if there wasn't. And like they intended for you to just play it that treacherously. What about big footprints? Oh, hang on, actually. You know? I feel like having a harness oh. today. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah. Oh. Uh. Hey, buddy, how you doing? <laughs> so how how do we make this awful? <laughs> Put him in a pot. That's not that's not attached properly. Hang on. Oh, I won't go in. It won't go in. That's all right. Wait, wait. Actually, hang on. This goes through stuff. Yeah. Hang on, sit, sit still. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, his face is secure. <laughs> Continue on our merry way. Okay, the musician is up the road here somewhere. He's doing all right. My, mind your head on the steps. <laughs> oh no. He's fighting back! Okay, well... You're really gonna regret that. Did you honor Mary Way? More damage than the mech you fought. <laughs> oh, he did actually. He took a full heart off. I don't have to eat a raw steak for that. He really tried to get us. You can hear the drum. He's, he's over here somewhere. Please, please rejoin the band. Oh, he's actually got a, a baron. It's an Irish instrument. Not quite, it's, I mean, it's a type of drum, sure, but that's cool. What? I don't interrupt. I've been busy calling bees with my beat. Oh. That was goofy, but I gotta try. See, the conductor in the musical troupe I play has been a little down. We gotta make him honey crepes. That should cheer out our maestro up. Aww. Can't get my hands on any coarser bee honey. Mm. Three combs of honey. Mm -hmm. Do I do I simply Aww. have honey already? Don't think I do. Have any honey? I might have already used it all to like cook meals. Ah, I'm one short. Hey, okay, where did he say we could get some? Different quest. Uh, from the hives near the Kakariko village chasm. Sure, we can just fast travel there. Still thinking about the Korok, our father killed in cold blood. Which one? Gonna have to be more specific. Any ideas now we access the ring ruins? I don't know how to get in there yet. I'm I'm guessing I have to go around and investigate the other sites. And maybe it unlocks. Make our way around here. I wonder if that one Korok's still in the well. No, he's probably with God now. Don't worry. He, he, he escaped that well. He got out of there. <laughs> Gonna absolutely steal it. Bees. <laughs> Buddy. It's rude. Okay, that should be all the bees. Um 
fastest way back is probably... Dude, stop! There's no need for that. I was trying to let him live. Fastest way back. Rock it away. The mech did as much damage as a Bacoblin. Is there a dragon here? Oh, hey, how's it going? That's a, that's a new one. I don't think we've gotten anything from this. We can get a scale. Here, I'm gonna need to... Will you stop? Is that giving me the updraft? Oh, he's just straight up going into the ravine. Okay. You know, we can pick up a quick part here. Unbearable cold, because it's the ice one. Put on... Our warm boots. There we go. Major skill. Oh, perfect. And we can use this to get the boost to get back to the bee guy. Just fly on up. Perfect. There he goes. Can we pick up the spike parts as well? Uh, I mean, we could have, but we don't really need them at the moment. You can get, like, ice weapons and that. I, I guess that would have actually been good. There's a sapphire, maybe, on the magic rod. I don't know if the sapphire only works on the magic rod, so, like, if anything else will do it, too. The check. Encountered every dragon too. Like I mean, there's the tr three usual ones, and then the addition light dragon. A whip of a honey crepe for the conductor. Here's a hundred dollars. Yeah, get get on back to the band. I want to get. My four star armor. 100 American dollars. <laughs> it was like 0 0.11 of a Bitcoin, Link. Have fun. Hundred and forty four Canadian dollars. <laughs> it's like the currency is specific. Goro coin. You know you, no, it'll be a Unobo coin, because they already got you like Unobo Co. Oh, uh, I think this is the full band. They're all together. Beats is back. That means we have one last voyage. For the band. We need to get you back to the final great fairy. Oh. 
Come with me. Bridge to the Great Ferry is broken. How are horses supposed to cross? Huh. You can cross the river to the river, everyone. All together now. Yeah, yeah. The Great Ferry will give you her blessing when she wakes up. Oh, they're just setting off. They don't even need me this time. No, no, they, they, they still need me. Okay, yeah, they immediately got stuck. Okay, don't worry, gang. I know a way to get us across. What have we got? I've only got one rocket. Oh no, maybe I don't know a way to get him across. Even the game's like, hey, have you considered like a flying machine? Okay, let's let's get these parts out. Steering wheel. Battery down. See what we got to work with. Okay, I've got- I- I might be able- I have one shot with a rocket. I think I can make it work. Also, what happened to your wheels? Why does someone keep stealing these? Hop in. I'll take you. What's more, I, I I think I'm really gonna try and make this work, right? I'm gonna give them a stabilizer. So they don't just immediately die. Okay, gang. My last rocket. You should be honored that I've decided to use it on you. Godspeed. Perfect landing. I really should have gotten the craft. Now I gotta walk. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> this man knows his rockets now. <laughs> Like, they're just directly there. <laughs> no questions asked. Certified NASA rocket engineer. <laughs> and the band is all here. Now give me stronger pants, please.
Chloe add a wee gold hole in one animation. Like, wow, you got the high score. Oh, you don't need to do that, Chloe. <laughs> Final fairy. Uh -huh. Give me stronger pants. We've done it. My heart just picked up the tempo. The musical stands of the stable trotters are the cure for anyone's malaise. Thank you once again. I've prepared a token of thanks so substantial. I hope your pockets are double stitched. Deserve every last bit of it. Here's a hundred American dollars. This is as much as I got for the bees, but okay. Every time the great fairies emerge in response to our music, gave all of us in the troop confidence in our plane. If you want to hear my beats, stop by a stable. But there, I'll give you a rhythm to remember. Show's it's not over. Far from it. We're just getting started. Keep playing and make audiences smile all over the kingdom. Mm. Just pour all our thoughts and feelings into our music when we play. Now I want our music to suit every traveler who comes to the stables, not just the great fairies. Oh. Consider you an honorary member of our grand stable trotters troop. I know your name. Oh. Link. So we that's what we can call the hero who saved our grand troop. Yeah, yeah. I'll remember that. I surely will remember. To continue playing for one and all under a new name. We are the Stable Trotters no more. Yeah, yeah. In honor of this genuine hero, let us be known as the Stable Heroes. Not as good of a name. Not as good. They'll absolutely forget it in the next game, too. You have the drums lit fire deep in my heart. Enhance my clothes and increase the power to the maximum. Oh, where is it? Oh, no, we're missing a few Sunderlines. Okay, I'll get them. That's fine. 20, 20 armor pants. 20 armor. 500 rupees, but it's absolutely worth it. <laughs> oh, and Link's just, Link's just dead. <laughs> He's been destroyed. 20 armor, like that's so good. Okay, let me just go get a few Sunderlines real quick. Like, look how much armor we have! It's 54! It's so good! Okay, we can go up to just here and we can just check where there's some flowers. I need six more. Ronky needs Zelda scales to upgrade the champions tune. We've got all, all the upgrade materials outside of Sunder Lions are just like pieces of Zelda. Basically. Yeah, let me let me yo, like Zelda, like let me just like like clip your nails there. Hang on. I need to make my armor better. Let me just chisel this out of your horn. Hang on. Like, it's kind of fucked up, Link. Like what 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 are you doing? We're looking for Sunderlines. Uh, I gotta just like comb the islands a little. We're here somewhere. We're on most of the islands. We need six. Might not get enough on the, just this one. Are we up there? Price is like none. There's other stuff here. There's a stand bulb. Where's all the Sunderlines gone? 
I don't know where is a good spot to farm these other than just like wander on the sky islands. Kind of like hope for the best. Get rockets. Uh, there's no rockets on that one. Let's go to another one. Where's all the Sunderlines gone? Like none here. We must have picked this one clean earlier. I'll check down there. I wanna I wanna get the armor upgraded. That's just gonna increase like that's survivability up pretty much to the maximum once we have it. Seriously, where where is it? Oh neat rockets! <laughs> Now let's restock a little. Slap, uh, slap some of these on. Yeah, there's like, there's like nothing here. As far as the Sunderlions go, uh, I'll okay. I'll hop back down to the mountain then. We'll we'll continue looking for those. Another island over there. Okay, they're talking about like the heart of the mountain. So I'm guessing like right here. Hey, how's it going? Wait, Zelda? Oh, Link, you came to save me. You recognize who I am, right? Zelda! You need to come and save me quickly. Do something to open this cage. It's, it's not gonna be her. Only the valiant golden-haired knight known as Link could move such a sturdy cage like that. I knew we'd learn some heroic wannabes if we use Zelda as bait, but... We've even managed to snare you. Don't worry, once we find the real Prince Zelda, we'll send her to join you, promise. And everybody's definitely the golden haired golden boy, get him. Yuga Clan just hates us. He's teleporting behind us. Just gonna spin. <laughs> Fight. Play off easy for now, don't get used to it. We won't hold back next time. Schmelda strikes once again. Ah. They deal less damage than the Korok did as well. Like, that Korok has got the deadliest blow on us in a while. He really did a number on us. Everything else has been, like, tame in comparison. Taste eight of the stories relating to the Princess Zelda. Here's some oh. more money. Here's a little bit more money. There he goes. Time to get the fr more frog armor. He hasn't given us another bit yet. I believe he gives it to you when you complete the quest. Like, that's how we did it last time. Okay, uh, I... <sighs> I really just want to get Sundal Lions. Maybe, okay, if we get up there, though. If we figure out what's happening in here. And then we work our path up there. Maybe that's a good way to do it. So we'll start here and we'll go into the forest. We can explore all this section here. Because I haven't actually gone that way yet. Tarrytown construction site is Sundal Lions. Does it? Okay.
can check later. Can you turn off the weather? Yeah, sure thing. Hang on. Give me, give me, give, give me just a moment. We just dial back with the old thermostat there. Sorry, I don't know what I've been thinking the last few years, you know, just making it warmer and warmer every summer. Sorry, apologies there, gang, you know, I've... Just fell in my pocket, you know, the dial just kept turning. Make our way into the rainforest. This is the, the wrong forest, but we can make our way over a bit. There's an electric dragon from before. We, I could go get a picture of him just for the album. I don't particularly want to fight him. <laughs> a shrine there? It is a shrine. No, it's not. Looks like it should be. Oh, okay, it's just the shape. We're good. Yeah, I, I, I'm thinking personally, like, there's something in here that's gonna be the solution for, like, the, th the storm in the sky above us. Maybe down here? Like, there was a big shrine here before. It'll be worth checking. When is he getting to Gerudo? Uh, we're kind of going off on a side venture today. Probably get there next week. I just realized the map actually gives detailed coordinates. I never noticed that. Like, the numbers. That's what that is. Describe exactly where you are, the people. Aha! <laughs> I got him with the blip! Opaz magic rod. Pretty good. Hey, friend. Get. Let's just do an explore. Let's see what we can find here. Where do you act? Thank you for the 100 bits. Watch the Z coordinate when you fall into the depths. <laughs> Like, down I go. <laughs> yeah, I'll pay attention to that. Just plummeting from the heavens. Been here ever since the 40 minute mark. I need a drink. Work away. Work away. I'm just exploring. I think you'll be okay for the next few minutes. I'm gonna quickly do the final boss when that guy leaves. Don't tell him. I'm gonna just run straight there, beat him, and the stream just ends. General, thank you for a thousand bits. First time catching a stream, just want to thank you for the endless entertainment you provide over the years. Watching you play this while I explore Hyrule for myself is so much fun, and I'm glad I've been able to enjoy this experience. Hey, thank you very much. It's very kind of you. Glad you enjoyed the content. Oh, God, that's some high-level enemies. Why are you just, like, in a random forest? I don't understand. <laughs> Our armor is put is armor is putting the work on the weird voice back, sorry. Our armor. I can I can get another I get another picture. There we go.
Oh my god, that was nasty. Man. Did, like four stakes. I'm gonna get ya. Doolin's so good for just lining up the headshots. <laughs> This weapon is just too slow on him, too. Yeah. Get Master Sword Charge. God. Still not as strong as the Korok, somehow. Come on, Tulin. Eat a steak. I don't know why they're just here. They're only supposed to... I mean, they're only really supposed to be in the sky in that. Supposed to, quote-unquote. But, but, yeah, they're, they're just living down here, I guess. Yeah, let's get to the center of here and see if there's anything. But this was- there was a huge, like, shrine puzzle for this one, I think, before? That one I have? That's one I have. Where it's like, you have to follow, like, a snake to its root or something. And the snake was the river. I'm just curious if there's anything here now. Something not bad. This is such a massive temple, yeah. I feel like there's, there should be something here. Oh, it's the Yiga clan. <laughs> Give me Sunderlines, though. Ow. Bring a courage. Okay, what you got for us? Anything. If outsourced would offer his prayers, hear my plea. Oh, they're, they're worried about the, the big statue too. I've got two quests now telling me, hey, could you go check up on mom? Second one to like just be like that. We already know what happened to mom, like she's already fallen over. Not going too well for her. But we'll uh we'll head back before too long. Just to update the quest. Oh, that fall in here might be good. Maybe that might take us into the storm. No, we're still not gonna be able to see it. No, yeah, just don't. Like, why am I even like considering that? <laughs> that was so hellish before. Don't have any rockets left too. I I can't do it the way I did it before. We need to find something that actually helps us. I'm shocked there's no shrine around here. I feel like there should be something. I'm up here. Give a second companion, you said it with such such certainty as if it changes it. Oh, thank god I have like the roly poly, like Sonic the Hedgehog Fireman ability. That's gonna make a real difference in completely blind storm in the skies, you know? I don't think that translates like to something that actually helps us. 
in the storm. You got Sonic now. Gotta be worth something. Those ones are so close to the land. Your man's just set up on a random hill. I don't think there's even a town there. He's just set up camp. I'm shocked there's not like a shrine or something around here. I mean, there could be. It could just be in the forest. Keep looking. There's a plane up there. Islands. Tobio's Hollow. Don't mind that. It seems a bit calmer even compared to Breath of the Wild here. I remember like in that game, if you had any kind of like light, you needed like electric resist equipment to go anywhere. Because it was constant thunderstorm. Really dangerous. It will fight him in a mo. <laughs> Has he been attacked by demon hands yet? Yeah, we've beaten actually several sets of demon hands. I have like I have four demon king bows on me. Collecting them as like trophies. Get his toes. Can't quite get his toes. Halfway there. Oh, I forgot to take his picture. Ah, uh, he might be a bit late. <laughs> That's alright. Does anyone want, like, a royal weapon? There's just, like, so many here. Oh, sure. We'll take a royal bow. Pick up a royal broadsword. The caliber of equipment, like, everything is just dropping now is insane. I think it's- I think it's be tied to pieces of heart. We have so many. It just kind of helps us live, like, significantly longer. You can buy photos for the album if you don't have them. Really? Okay. That's kind of cool. Okay, well, we'll make our way to, like, the waterfall basin. Trying to see what else is of no- I'm shocked there's still, like, not been, like, even a shrine. We've covered quite a bit of land, even. Hey, friend. Okay, maybe there's something in here. Give us, like, some kind of checkpoint. It'd be nice. Hope you're doing okay, Bez. Good to have you here. That guy just jumped. Oh. <laughs> Sticky lizard, no. Okay, let's make our way through the chasm. I think we're supposed to get like a boat or something, I don't know. Anyway, here, here's the ideal path. Woo! The sneaky stairs.
I mean, this is great for me, because if they fall in the water, they just die. Let me get the monster parts before they drift off. Silver, horrible, and horn? I think he's supposed to have like a river raft and adventure here. Apparently monsters aren't waterproof. It's weird that, like they're even living here when it's like so treacherous, you know? See you in a few, Master Sword. Uh, we can use our marbled hammer. The light caves, they just can't swim. Well, this is like a poor choice of cave, ain't it? Another diamond, we have so many now. Might be able to get the Goron sword on top of like the Rito bow. Master Sword have any base damage. I, I don't know what it is. I think someone said before. It might have been like 30 or something. Which is honestly like pretty good for like a weapon that's regenerating. What's that? Continue our river adventure. Oh, there's, here's the frog at the end, too. This must be the end of the cavern. I think you're really supposed to, like, go down here on your raft. Yeah, let me, let me just grab out of the side. I wanna, I wanna get this stone. Oh, I missed a salt. Link is the raft. It feels it. I'm gonna go spelunking. Okay, what do we get for all that? Oh, the rubber helm! Okay, that, that's actually pretty good. We can make ourselves lightning proof if we get enough parts. We're only missing one more. The only way out is to remember that Ascend exists. Let's do exactly that. <laughs> Apparently the game was pretty much ready a year ago and they just spent a year polishing it making sure everything works okay. I mean that sounds right. Y you'd want to, considering how like potentially jank this game can be. You know, I'm, I'm glad they just took their time with it. That's pretty good. Um, still surprised there was no shrine. But it is what it is. It's so damn bright. Oh, we can get a good view of the waterfalls from here. Hang on. Have a look. I can't believe he's gotten this far into the game and hasn't even collected all the safe powers yet. I mean, I, I, I'm i just going. <laughs> it's my plan. If I had to guess that rock needs to get to the other spot.
be easy if I had rockets still available. What I can do... Simply hold it here, right? Just hold it here. We're just gonna exist a while. Oh, and it just plummets to the bottom. Okay, I thought it was gonna float. <laughs> I mean, that, that makes it easier. It's just collected air. Yeah, I guess, I guess it's a huge boulder. I, I should have expected this. Did I not do anything? <laughs> Thought I had to move it. Is there another boulder? Here, maybe? And there's another rock in the first thing, is there? Did not see it. Oh, is this just a Korok? Okay, we were massively overthinking this. <laughs> it's, it's all just to deceive you. Just a yahaha. Okay, bud. Oh, down we go. Let's see what we find. Oh, wait, there's totally a cave. Hang on. <laughs> I was kind of worried I'd stub my... <laughs> Dude, at least get let me get on the ledge, right? That's just rude. Make a vehicle of some kind. Sure, let's see what we got. Or just use fire. Fi fire could also work here, I feel. Fire might be the solution. There is something I've all I've wanted to try for a while though. Hang on. I just want to make like a cannon on wheels. Another, another take at the cannon technology. Oh, cannon. Construct head. Stick him on there. Move this around. Okay. Yeah, he's ready to take on the world. Go get him, pal. What? Why is that not moving?
It should still move. Okay, hang on, let me, let, me, let me move him a bit closer. Go. Go get him, pa Hang on, let me, let me just, uh... Make my way- Oh, you can't even burn those. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to go pick him up in a moment. Okay, but wait, what magical auto build constructions can we make here? Aerial cannon. Rocket platform. Ah, uh, this could be a chance for the beam cycle. Missing the obligatory pieces of wood at the side. Let's go. That's God, this really sucks. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Go get him! He's powered- he's powered up! Get in there! <laughs> Go on, bud! Go- go get him! God, the beam cycle's so awful. <laughs> Come on. And okay, now we're... Just gonna go on foot. None of my vehicles are working. It's comically awful. It's just... It's just not doing what it's supposed to. Okay, hang on. We can we can make something new? Oh, this could be a time to test my contraption from before. Where is it? Okay. So, what I need then... Check out devices. Three of these. Three cannons. Floating stone. We don't... Ah, uh, we might want the rocket still. We might want the rocket. Okay, here we go, gang. Yeah, we- You know, I'm just gonna hold this. And just pop it down as- Oh, you're so useless. Go get him! <laughs> it's still a prototype, right? It will work. It will do what we want eventually. Oh! Maybe, maybe don't stand in that bit of the map. So many explosive drops. It's a work in progress, remember. Uh, for now, we will simply 
slowly navigate the cave by clinging desperately to the sides. Oh. Yeah, though the walls are slippy. Alright. <laughs> I can't even get across. There we go. None of our contraptions are working the way we want them to. Apparently I've been in this cave from the other side? Oh, this is where... This is where I got the mushrooms. There was like a bunch of these or something like down here, yeah. Didn't explore in the stable before. There's so many of these and I needed them. Okay, well, I guess this entire dungeon was pointless. <laughs> but I haven't got any single shrine I can travel to, so I now need to get back through the cave. There was a way up. We could, we could, we could check up there. Oh, just a s- <laughs> we, don't, we don't need to bother with this. There we go. Somewhere new. Okay, and we can just navigate the mountain again. Forget it exists every time. Come on. Fair, it, it itself forgets it exists sometimes. Legend of Link's inability to look up. <laughs> Not as popular of a, like, a, a release in the Zelda series. Massive step down from the Ocarina of Time. Shitload of shock fruit for some reason. Just go have fun. I wonder where that attack came from. Okay. It's not a shrine, but it's something. We'll take what we can get at this point. Just need something we can actually travel to. Legend of Zelda Link's stiff neck. Power and tail of bad posture. I don't think I can burn this, can I? No, because it's raining. It's always raining. Yeah, what does the, the journal say? Pieces of wood, 120 rupees. I was so cold. I was cold from the rain, so I used them to warm up. Needed a few more tents to keep the luggage fire would dry in the rain, so I got them. I think that's what it's suggesting you do. You need to keep it an area dry so you can burn it. Make like a table. Alternatively,
No, no, it's it's actually the rain's actually putting it out. I mean, maybe it, it's it's quite the inferno. <laughs> to shelter this bit of thorns so that we can then destroy it. Okay, please. I could just long stick. Yeah, let's just fuck it. Old reliable. Uh, whatever this contraption is, you're now part of the long stick too. Spot the stand link. <laughs> Is that not doing it? Shelter. <laughs> It's sheltered. I can get this bit. This might burn the wood. <laughs> it's just the middle bit. Look at this, we've got it like sectioned off as well. If there's a gap, we just start sellotaping random shit. Let's see if that works. There we go. Yeah, we're good. Job well done. <laughs> Tower restored. Yeah, let's map this as well so we actually have a point we can travel. There's thorns at the top too. It's like, watch out, Link! Immediately dies. There's some really high islands in some of these parts of the map. Either like you have to commit to like just the spaceship. Or there's like another way you're supposed to traverse them. I'm absolutely shocked at the complete like lack of shrines in this area. From our exploration so far. Sky map updated. Okay, there is ominous boss arena. Not obvious boss arena. Uh, there is a tablet over there which we probably want to get. Question is, can I bloody see it? 
Oh, no, I can't. It's all the way up there. Jesus. It's so high. Right, there's a platform there. I might be able to commandeer. Got springs on it, sure. I wonder where the next dragon deer could possibly be. There's a pat! There's a sneaky stairs. Can traverse it. It's just really dangerous. Okay, there's the next one. Seems to be only one shrine for that entire area. There's got to be more than that. No, I'm, I'm not convinced. Like, I'm going to explore that more. There's got to be something in that forest. It seems weird, though. Like, there's so little, doesn't it? There's more springs. Help you on your journey. No sandal lines. Uh... Over there. There's gonna be something that helps us to get into that thunder area. It's gotta be. Determined to find it. Spring up here. What if you stack like 10 springs? You'd, you'd probably launch yourself into the stratosphere and perish. Probably would be it for you. There's yet another Minecraft golem. I, I don't even know if I want to fight him right away. We fought so many of them. <laughs> this I think we fought like three today alone. <laughs> yet another. Oh, but we might have to, because I think he's got- yeah, he's got the, st the shrine st stone on him. So, yes we do. Never mind. Launch a Korok off of 20 springs. I- that- That sound promising. Need- I need to- need to save up my materials, I think, more than anything. Take these for the capsule machine. I'm gonna pop into Lurland, love that area in Breath of the Wild. We probably should. Yeah, we, we should just uh, explore this area today. Like, I, I was thinking we might get round to, like, the Gerudo or something. But honestly, like, we have such a section of map. Like, look at the lack of shrines. There's got- there's gotta be something in here. There has to be. It's too empty. You did it, Link. It's, he's having a hard time today, right? I don't know if there's any, like, new parts left for us to get, or if we have them all now. More cannons, more steering sticks, more wheels. The light seems to be like a really useless one, it just drains power. Okay, well, let's fight 
Minecraft Steve Golem. Uh, number like, is it four today? I know I just lined that up, but I realized I should probably check here for the Sunderlines. Sammy, thank you for a thousand bits. Did you know the reason why every other species towers above Link is because in this game he is four foot eleven? Is he? I know Zelda's like a little taller than him. Link's a, Link's a little guy. I think this is here to help you get the stone back. Ah, yes, I think the, like, 20 springs here <laughs> might be a little telling. How am I ever going to return it? Pretty good start. He's ar he's already lost the stone. I I could just leave him be at this point. Okay, good boss. <laughs> We've become so strong. <laughs> do I even have anything to fuse this onto? I, I don't know if I do. I uh, I have a rank two. Yep, probably just that. Probably just destroy that. I can put something else on the other one. There we go. Even stronger blade. Okay, now we need to fashion some device with all of these springs to uh, get this rock back, which seems incredibly dangerous. Let's try and, uh, let me let me grab like the the construction here. I think it wants you to use this one. I mean, that- that will work, I think. I think it'll catch off that wall. Give it a go. A stabilizer? I don't even know what part that is. Don't overshoot. How to use all the springs. I'll, I'll take a spring for later use. Let's pop one in the Master Sword. I'm sure that's a good application. Call me the Spring Man. Yeah, let's try this. Birch, thanks for 100 bits. Hey, now bought bits for the first time to let you know I appreciate you. I know you get rid of those storm clouds. Ah, oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me. No, don't tell me. Jeez. <laughs> it's gonna, gonna stop reading. <laughs> not tell me. I do not want to know. I want to find out myself. I stopped reading. I know you had good intentions, but don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, catapult that across. You nonetheless. Yeah, I wanna I wanna figure it out myself. So 
sorry. No, you're all good. You're all good. Don't worry. Yep. Just, just let me let me figure it out and suffer. Let me figure it out and suffer. I'd much rather that. If I ask for help and I'm just like, how do I do it? Um, then you know, at that point you know, tell me. But like, otherwise, just assume I don't want to know. Even if I'm like a moron. <laughs> Just don't help me. Have you tried poking the storm with a long stick? You know, you might be on something there. You might, we haven't even considered that. That could work. It's another heart container. Got so many now. We tried turning off the weather again. It didn't work the first time, unfortunately. Maybe. What if you stuck a hundred fans together and aimed it at the storm? That should do it. In theory, yes. Just, just blow it away, <laughs> like... That'll learn ya. Look how far away that ominous boss arena is. Oh my god, you gotta- like, that is a trek. I don't think that's it there. It's miles away. The thing is, we already fought King Gleok, so like, I don't know what like an arena like this could have. Because I would have thought that King Gleok is like the end all be all of bosses. I kind of want to get over there. I think I can. I don't know how. Gonna <laughs> need a really big spring, no. Not 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 the spring technique. The main problem with actually traversing this is that the items might wear out. How do we do it? Could, I could use the fan bike again. Honestly, if I actually just make my, like, plane again, if I make my plane with the rocket, that might be enough. Plane with rocket tends to serve as well. Give us some batteries. Give us a steering stick. Either that or a really long stick. It's the only favorite one I have is like two rockets and that's fine. Just get our rockets back. Pull it back a bit just so it doesn't go off the edge. There we go. This is probably the best way to get it, and then we can get like a substantial amount of height. It's like, surely there's gotta be something good. Like, this is over Eventide Island as well, which is like... Eventide Island itself is like one of like the final shrine challenges of the game. So like, there's gotta be good stuff down there, you know? It has to be. Okay, flying machine is at the ready. Let's go. We want to keep gaining altitude. 
if we can. Because it's so absurdly high. Altitude is going to carry us further. So far. There's got to be something good out here. It's like literally the edge of the world. In like the most inaccessible location. Okay, try and get some more height. Height is key. Height is key. Okay. I think I can make it here with some stamina food. Okay, it's another king. He's just at the edge of the world. I can get his photo! Okay, this, this is a much more dangerous approach, though, than our previous setup was. God, I hope he's not near me as I get near the island. The Nutter King Gliok. He's just minding his own business and you're here to beat him up. You're goddamn right. <laughs> okay, well, we already know what the strat is for this. It's it's called key size. Uh, we just need to make sure that we have enough. Yeah, I should be fine. Plenty. Okay, yeah, the problem is getting down. God. <laughs> okay. All right, battle stations, people. Drink some of that speed elixir. We just started launching. Okay, now quickly. Get the picture! <laughs> there's a... There's a dragon in there somewhere! <laughs> okay, this one feels like he has more health. Either that or the Spring Master Sword is really bad. And we should not be using it. Probably the Spring Master Sword. If there was ever a time to use the Silver Lionel Blade, this is it. Oh, look at that damage! Get him with that. Uh, what other eyeballs have I got? It's so hard to just find what you're looking for sometimes in this menu. Uh, let me just. 
We just go from a copious amount of inventory. Oh, that was clean. Let a dragon defeat it. Uh, I'm guessing. I'm guessing if it's this far out, it has to be like a sage's wisdom. It's like literally the end of the edge of the entire world. Can you take photos for my wedding? After reviewing your work, you seem more than capable. Yeah, sure thing. Yeah, there we go. Sage as well. I'd be, I'd be kind of devastated if it wasn't a reward like that. I have some Sunderlines too. So, this is literally the edge of the world. Like, there's nothing else over here. It's so high up. Oh, that said, it goes higher. It does go higher pretty much everywhere, it seems. Jesus. We can pop down to Eventide. I'm kind of just worried more than anything that it's going to be like Eventide was uh, back in Breath of the Wild, which was not fun. <laughs> in terms of like the actual difficulty it poses. Incredibly challenging. I don't think there's anything else here that I can realistically go to. I'm not going to see it in the sky because I've yet to map it. There's a moon out there somewhere. You just dive into hell. Apparently that has opened up below eventide. So this island in Breath of the Wild would have been regarded as, like, one of the hardest challenges. Like, to the extent they made an entire challenge DLC just based around this island. Now, it doesn't seem to be teleporting us away instantly, so that's a good sign. Let's see what's at the edge of the world, though. Also, I should not be using just the, the, the Lionel sword like this, willy-nilly. I need, I need to save that. Probably won't use that next until, like, Ganon or something. There's gotta be at least a shrine here. I'd be shocked if there wasn't. A lot of flying kit. Oh, that's, that's still the Lionel bow. Hang on, that might be overkill. Monster forces uh, are, are struggling, to say the least. Oh, they're, they're gunning for me. <laughs> the spring. <laughs> it's just going to do that. I, ki I kind of need the master sword to break. <laughs> the last hit is just going to catapult. <laughs> Out of here! Silver Lazalfa's tail, that's pretty good. <laughs> the 
The no I mean the noise is amazing. The noise is incredible. But it is just gonna also bop everyone away from me. In times of conflict. What's in here? Soarin' Boomerang? I haven't actually found, like, boomerangs at all. Yeah, I forgot that was even a weapon type in this. Um... I can try it. It, in theory, just comes back, doesn't it? Like if I throw this. You gotta catch it. Okay, well, well, we'll give it a go. Yeah, they've had some development on the island since we... Would have last been here. I'm not seeing a shrine or anything, which is shocking. There's gotta be one. Get all this way out. There's, there's just more monster forces. What has he even got on his horn there? Spear. Oh god. <laughs> Aha! Go, my trusty boot. It's gone. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. We can just boing him around. <laughs> What weapons have I used? This is damage too. Let's chuck that at him as well. Got a spear. There's so many silver monster parts now. We're gonna be able to make such good gear. Tap a flamethrower to the boomerang to make the death machine. I mean, that sounds kind of cool. And, uh, it, apart from the fact, though, that when you throw it, it's just not gonna come back. It seems. Well, there it was. I don't even know how it got in there. Okay, another monster encampment cleared. For the island. They've really been trying to make a life for themselves here, it seems. This is Got like a nice settlement in that. We're just here to pill for their supplies. Oh, that's the wrong one. Hang on. Turn that off. What's all your loot? see it. Give me your eyes, please. I fight King Gleok for like the third time. It will be necessary. You left the Roomba. He hates Roombas. Just, just exploring. Down the hole. Well, down the hole, there's gonna be like the the light route, but there should be a correspondent shrine. I'm actually kind of shocked that like I don't just see it. You know? 
I mean, there's a cave inside the mountain somewhere. Here for your niece. Yep. I like the high trines and caves in this game. Yeah, they do. Like, they've gone all in their new cave system. Uh, if I go, if I maybe just go to the underground, I might be able to find it. Plus, it's like over here somewhere. It tends to be shrines near the ravine entrances. There's an explorer out here. My God. What are you doing? I want to go home. Ooh. Because of a debt wish to make your way to this island. But the rumors, right? They say that this is where the pirates that attacked Lurlin village hide out. Oh, we've just killed them at the source then. The island has three monster strongholds. We we've already defeated two. Hmm. I mean sure. <sighs> Seeking the pirate hideout. Oh, we're helping Lurlin, so yeah, we'll, we'll get back there and actually see what's happening. Eventually. Fuck up on bananas. Only one to go, yeah. Could just probably set up camp here and snipe them all. Two. I actually, actually can't see any of them. <laughs> Just want to break the boxes. You, you just do your thing. Just pop up next to him. There's got to be one that's like actually stronger. It's it's just this one guy. And he's going to make up most of the help bar. <laughs> good. Um, did anyone see him? Oh, he's trying to make his way back up. Hang on. This one guy is like the last surviving captain. Yeah, the island has been cleared. Korok hanging out by the chasm too. Every time too since I just saw a pirate ship coming in. It's strange as soon as it went around the rear side of the island the ship disappeared. Oh they have a pirate cove. That's cute. Ah. Okay, let's go, let's go find him. Now they must die too. Yep. Head down to hell afterwards. I remember this being a really annoying part of the challenge where there's like an item in the middle there. on the edge of the world. It's so cool they actually have like a quest or like something different to do on the island this time. 
I was thinking it would just be like, hey, you know, you're naked again, survive. Because I feel like if they were going to, like, just revisit, like, straight up a shrine challenge like that, this would be one to do it with, you know? But it's actually kind of cool that they just did something new. Yeah, it, 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 I, I love seeing how, like, the kingdom has changed between the years. Eventide Island Cave. Now, I feel like this could be, like, a big stealth session, section or something, but we're just going in. <laughs> Fair to be bored it. Take another diamond. I can hear him coming for me. Ooh, that's a lot of explosives. Okay, just in case this explosives. Clear the map there. There's a lot of them on the deck. Wait, this could be a time. Hang on. This is my moment. Hey, go get him. Fuck! Okay, just pop it up there. It did some damage! Did it. On the boat. Drown apparently under these stairs. Still need to activate the cannon stand. Oh, that's why it's not working. Of course, you're right. I'm just kind of worried about making the entrance here because there's so many explosives just like right to my left. Go, my cannons! I said, Go, my cannons! They're working! <laughs> Look at them take aim! I can get him and the cannons. Go, oh, my children! Oh, God. God damn it. It's friendly fire. Okay, we can spring our way up. Right. Okay, hang on. I gotta, I gotta actually land on the ship, though. This is just embarrassing. <laughs> like, has he really not died? Are you sure? Hang on, it's now or never. Did a bomb jump. 
Hang on, how's my contraption doing? Get him! Let me, let me, let me just hold it up. No, it's, all, it's already given up. <laughs> I'm getting killed. Because I'm trying to make this stupid thing work. Silver boss bacoblin horn. That is that's pretty cool. Boss bacoblin guts. There we go. You've been successfully boarded. There's the shrine too, so there is one on the island. Well, presumably the village is gonna be okay now. We, we've, uh, really cleared them out already. Anyone see the frog? I'm assuming there's a frog? Does it count as a cave? I don't know. Let's get into the shrine. Oh, you need to fashion a little bridge. Hang on. There. Peaceful, long stick moment. Oh, look at all their supplies, too. They, like, really organize their kit. We just get to pilfer it all now. Give me, give me everything you got. Roasted porgies? Sure. Did it. Yeah. That one. I thought you said roasted corgis. Uh, that would be that would be quite alarming. No, you're good. What's going on with the shadows there? Did you see that? Almost freaking out. Pirate Island has been cleared. Now we need to clear out Pirate Hell. And see what's happening down there. Like round two against the pirates. Here's like as many precious stones as you can carry too. Appreciate it, game. Yeah, I want to see what the chasm is, because it's going to be completely self-contained. Like, there's no way of connecting with the mainland, you know? There's, there's got to be something good. Why was King Gleok in pirate heaven? <laughs> I don't know, actually. I don't know why he was, like, hovering over here in particular. They really just wanted to put him at the end of the world. Dragons love gold, maybe. Maybe that's the basis for it. Okay. That was really fun, though. Saved the island. I wonder what this guy's gonna give us. He's pirate god. I need to get him off this island probably next or something. You're like a one-man monster control crew. Part of a monster control crew, I still lost my nerve. Thanks to you, I can finally breathe easy. Oh. Accept this with my thanks. He's just got these for some reason. <laughs> Picked it up in a previous monster cr control crew expedition. Hold on to it as a lucky charm all this time, but you probably get more use out of it than I would. <laughs> and I tried to put together a report on what happened here and finally leave the island. I'm back, I'm turning over a new leaf, no more scaredy sesame. Be capable and courageous like you. He's he's absolutely gonna die. 
We, we jumped down from the sky after killing Dragon God to clear Pirate Island, and now we're jumping into Pirate Hell. I, I worry for his well-being if like, he's looking up to us. Oh. God, why is it completely dark? There's something over here. Lone Island Coliseum. They have one down here. Yeah, let's let's see what enemies are even in it. I don't know if I, I have it in me to do a second Coliseum. <laughs> it was so tough before. It lighted up. Oh, geez, yeah, it just drops you straight, like, over it. And my fear coming down here is, like, honestly just finding the Kuldara Worm again. They scared the shit out of me, like, they're actually terrifying. Something over here. <laughs> There's a point back up, but I wonder where this is actually going to lead to. If anywhere of note. Let's quickly check it. Oh, cool. Let's, uh, let's, let's just see what's in it. Because we could see the Lionels before, in the last one. The last one did straight up give us Majora's Mask as well, so surely it's gotta be something good again. Ah, oh, that's the thing, like, what could the treasure be? If it's fucking Majora's Mask. Hey, here's Majora's Pants. Oh, what's that? Let's just see what's in it. We don't have to fight it if we don't want to. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Other than just here's your Colosseum. Sword here. So we'll just play more. Um, do I have anything I can toss? I really don't have anything. Uh, but what I can do is I can take this, stick that on. <laughs> Super sword. It's Majora's Utter Mask. <laughs> but, uh, here's my spare. Sometimes I gotta take it out for dry cleaning, you know, so I gotta hold on to something. Oh, it's is it just a bacoblin? I think I think they're just goblins. We might be all right for this. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna chance it. Get in position. Hang on, I can I can. Oh, of course, because my camera app is psychic. Might just tell me what's in here. Is 
No, it's not gonna this time. It's just Bacoblins, yeah. It's just Bacoblins. I mean, there's a white Bacoblin in there, so, you know, it's gonna be a stronger caliber, but I think I can take them. Bacoblin army. That seems doable. It can't be worse than five Lynels. Like, because that, that was particularly rubbish. <laughs> and they're still gonna be at one at a time. They, they even start with, like, the lower caliber ones. Yeah, th this, this is just easy in comparison. God, we may have just done the hardest one. This is, like, one with, like, five King Gleox. I think we're doing good. The music's not even that intense. Right, camera, please, if you could whip back a little faster. We're over halfway uh, there now. Like already. Like this is this is just one white Bacob. We've we fought like twenty of them at this point. Okay, well played though. Hang on. <laughs> He's just gonna be beaten up in like a corner as, as we just like go through our inventory and eat some mushrooms. Take the photo. I, I I thought we got one of a white carbon. Did we not? Take it anyway. Silver even. Yeah, we want to get his parts. Uh, honestly. Just, <laughs> just treat ourselves a little there. There's only there's only two left. Uh, I can use my Boko Reaper. All your tea. Yeah, that was so that was so easy in comparison. That was just lovely and straightforward. Shouldn't have worried so much. I think like just the first one to be in like fucking five Lionels has set the precedent. The, the precedent that's got me kind of on edge whenever I see one of these. There was one in the Korok forest too. Could even go there. Just pick up all the parts. Yeah, what we got? Be something good. Oh, Minda's helmet. Okay. Gives seven armor and gloom resistance. That's Pretty good. Can I upgrade this? Or is it like Majora's Mask where it's not upgradable? It's cool. Can't upgrade. Unfortunate. Oh, but it's cool. Required another crown for our collection. That's really cool, yeah. I'm alright with some gloom resist too. That that seems like generally useful. And there's just nothing else down here. It's just this Colosseum. 
Nice little easy zone. You can see something just at the tail end of this. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, that's even tide completely cleared out. Swag light princess. <laughs> yeah, we'll go get the tier that's down here next. Um, that seems important. Uh, what I'm actually gonna do is I'm actually gonna take a bathroom break because I've not actually taken one um, since we start the stream. So it might be a good time just to get that in. Uh, we'll be just a few minutes. Ah, oh, Point Crow, good to see you as well. How you doing, man? Point Crow, we've not died again. Well, I, I, we died at the tutorial start. I just wanted to let you know. I meant to t tell you at some point. We've been doing permadeath. I've only died once. It's at the tutorial. I stubbed my toe. I have it on the map. Because I jumped into this lake and hit the one single bit of brick that was sticking out and died right here. <laughs> That's it. It's my only death. But otherwise, we have not perished. We met because of Brad the Wild Permit. That we did! No, we did! It's mad. I wanted to tell you at some point. I hope you're well, man. I hope you're having fun yourself. I also made a house that, that says fuck. Hang on. Uh, it's <laughs> Real quick before the bathroom break. This is just important to show off. Hang on. Yeah, some people there have joined the stream late, so they didn't e they didn't even know that we did this today. I, yeah, this is this is important to show off. This is this is uh, Link's fuckhouse. <laughs> uh, thank you, the Tears of the Kingdom, for making this possible. It's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna quickly use the loot. I'll be back in like a minute or two. See you in a moment. House tour, it's it's honestly, it's kind of difficult to give the tour. There's the prayer room. I think that's a weapon stand up there. I haven't been able to check. There's the study. There's the study I accidentally put the wrong way up, so we've kind of had to just leave it like that. Uh, the shield armory's doing a great job. I was able to actually put a shield on the wall. The kitchen is like the only usable room, and I've stored a single bow on the wall here. It's got every vital room. I, I think the door is supposed to be there in the sea. <laughs> that's, that's your main entrance. There's the stable as well. 
Yeah, I, I'm I'm having a great time with this game though. I'm having so much fun. Ah, yeah, this is this is this is Link's house. I'm gonna tweet it out a little later tonight, I think. But is Beauty Make the YouTube? Absolutely. Well, I, you know, it's we're gonna have to like restructure the entire house. So that instead of fuck, it spells YouTube. Which is gonna be a really elaborate sensor of like, just Minecraft blocks just jammed everywhere. I'm so sorry, Chloe. Yeah, it's gonna- it's gonna be really tough to censor this one. <laughs> um, but you know, it's necessary- no, don't, don't. Ah, <laughs> fuck. Oh, no. Okay. But enough fucking about. Um, let's go down here and get the Tear of the Kingdom. And we're gonna explore more of this area of the map. We have to save the village, I think. The Tear of the Kingdom. <laughs> it's what they are, though. Like, you go around the world and you collect the Tears of the Kingdom. That have been left behind by the legend of Zelda. Like, I'm not wrong. That's- that's what it is. Okay. Let's just catapult ourselves here. I wanna- can I reach that island? No, because it, it takes a little too long to deploy. Maybe? Maybe there's a way up. Yeah. It's got to be real close. No, because now, now you're on the problem of how do I scale this vertical cliff? Uh, for which I do not see an answer. I can take out my shield. Like, mid-flight. Wait, can you do that? No, you can't. Because <laughs> we actually checking. Okay, let's go, let's go pick up the tier of the kingdom. It's down here. It's gonna take a little longer to hop on over because we've lost most of our momentum here. It's all right. Also, let me not live dangerously here. And let me get a raw steak. There we go. Simply fall. I've been so terrified of fall damage, like the entire game. Like, straight up just makes me uneasy. Oh, what's over here, actually? I have a little campsite. My poor restaurant. Hi. Oh, these are the guys who've been cast out of the village. Okay, hang on. I, I can help you out. Let's go liberate it. Now, yeah, where, where do you need to go, friend? Yeah. Okay, what, what technology do we have that might help him? I could just strap him to a sled and hope for the best. I got- oh, oh, it's already coming out. Well, you know, maybe you might catch up with it. Oh, I've got a great idea, actually. Hang on. Hang 
my god, Yiga clan, please. I'm doing something important right now. But don't salotape them onto it. Hope you find your friend. And stop. <laughs> he's he's absolutely dead. No, he's he's gone. He's gone. <laughs> Every bone in his body has been shattered. We can't help him. Cannot help him. He's gone. Is this for another Korok? Tell me, there's a second one here. No, that 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 might have been for him. This, this might have been the tools you were supposed to use. Oh, we lost another one, gang. Sad day. This back too? Oh? It's a shadow. I think I'm under attack when it's like all that is just moving. It's just the island shadows. Yeah, it looks really trippy on the landscape. We could have like probably a full extra weapons, like uh, like two or three weapon slots, if we hadn't just like tortured so many of the poor Koroks. Like some of them, like we just throw in a ditch and we just walk on. <laughs> okay, challenge shrine. Try it. We drowned one. Yeah, we did. We we crucified one. That's probably the most brutal. Got a long stick. What can I do? You don't see me. Do I even have a bow? I don't even have a bow. Is there anything in the box? No. It's just... <laughs> Hell, get him! Oh, that's dangerous. Oh, I don't like this one. Okay, all right, get... Just get out, just get out, yep. Yeah. Oh, I'm not feeling confident about that one. That's a real bad spot. That's a really bad spot to be in, like, just to start it. Let me, let me reset my position. It's the fact that I have the shock arrows and I have, like, nothing. Okay. Yeah. So I think though, is that a stone barrel? I can equip some barrel sledge. I'll, I'll take what I can get. The, the lightning bolts are terrifying. Shot. Whoop. 
the fact that they're just shooting from across the map. That's like a big AOE blast, too. Like, I'm struggling to even get on the raft. Oh my god. I, I got it. Okay, I, I see the path. Those are time bombs. Okay, really bad spot to be standing. <laughs> Jesus game. Oh my god, and they're all just going round. Do I have any arrows? Six. Okay, if they if you knock them in the water, it's an insta-kill. Just do that a few times. On his way around. Might be able to knock that middle guy in. I'm just worried if I'm standing here, they're just gonna take pot shots at me. Might be able to engineer it so this guy falls in. Here we go. Oh, you bastard. He's almost in. He's in. Construct there, and then there's just this, this guy over here. <laughs> on the ladder, please. Okay, it's just one left. That was a really scary setup for that shrine. I think we got him. He just instantly dies. <laughs> like I slipped! He fell into the swimming pool. Yeah, that, was, that, that was a tough one. I'll make a boat stick. Can I just pick up a boat? And fuse it with one? Oh, I don't think I can. <laughs> I don't think I can. Not those boats. Captain 4 Reaper with durability up. Like, the game the game is spoiling us. Boomerang kind of sucks. Get rid of that immediately. We threw it once. It didn't come back. Keep going forward. Use a boat with the sword. <laughs> you want me to go back in and get the boat sword? I mean, I mean get like, is the master sword ready? Can I can I get a power of boat in it? Yeah. I 
me just let me just pick this up real quick. How does the boomerang suck so much in this game? I feel like there's probably a way to use the boomerangs better. But I'm just not. Oh, they all respawn. Jesus. Okay, no, you can't pick it up. It's too big. Not with Fuse. You can't with Fuse. Ultra Hand you might be able to, but you can't with Fuse. We were trying to Fuse it. It's alright. Uh, here's... Here's the village. Oh god, it's actually been, like, decimated. <laughs> oh no, they've, they've completely destroyed it. We, we must free the village. From the pirate menace. There's an awful lot of them here. That's why we're gonna just go straight to the captain. If we can't take him out. I'm a deer in this vessel. Yeah, uh, let me let me just get like a good start here as well. Hang on. <laughs> just pepper him a bit. Eat a steak. I'm guessing this guy is probably most of the force. Got a big sword. Oh! <laughs> Call him for the troops. <sighs> You're doing great, you know. <laughs> I need to get rid of those. Because they're just too dangerous to have on the, on the deck. Only time to you No, it's not. Keep the Demon King bows. Need to get the guy up there. Come on! <laughs> Buddy, I just... He was ready to go! <laughs> Jesus! I just came up out of the ground and it's like, I see him! I got him in my sights! I gotta, I gotta just find the way to get back on board. <laughs> I think I just run for the shore. <laughs> he completely knocked me off. Okay. Uh, well, it's a lovely way. To just navigate the higher ground. Can we hop on? Moving platform. Oh, 
Yeah, hey, sorry about that. Your your lieutenant just like had a go at me. I take out the shield. Oh, it's because he had the mushroom stick. That's why. Yonobo is just beating up this guy, meanwhile. They must have, like, a lot of forces then, yeah? Because, like, this guy is only taking, like, a small fraction of it away. It's actually kind of scary. Not even halfway, and, like, that's the big boss. All his fangs. You gotta clean up the entire town. Okay, quick work, maybe? Yeah, what would you do? If you land in the water slightly more, that's what I thought. Like, I can't quite reach the bottom anymore, and he instantly dies. Not even a chance to drown. Jumpy? We can, we can fight with this. Maybe it's useful self-defense. No, we don't have space. Oh no, I'm 10 centimeters from reaching the bottom. Instantly dies. It could happen to you. Like, you gotta be careful. You go slightly too deep in the pool. Like, that's it. You're gone. Are they down the well as... Why is there so much smoke coming out of here? Do I check this? It's just this, this guy's just living. He's just trying to find his way in this world, and we're like breaking into his home and killing him. He just wanted to have his dinner. There wasn't even like a ladder or anything, like most people jumping in there, they wouldn't even be able to get back out, like you'd have to actually get trapped yourself. Just to kill him. Let's charge up. Uh, where is my summon gang? Oh, good lord. Come on, Tulin. Really trying to get him. God love them. They don't know. They don't have help. Like there's nothing they can do against the shadows. I think even with Wolf Link before in Breath of the Wild, when you can summon him as like a companion, um, he still had a help bar. Like he could straight up just die in that, and you have to resummon him. Because here they're just immortal.
Got him. I still need to go back and actually upgrade my armor, I'm just realizing that. We never found all the Sunderlines, did we? <laughs> we've done like, we've gone into like pirate hell, pirate heaven and everything in that time. We really shouldn't have done any of this before then. Yeah, we got sidetracked again. This all started like, hey, I'm gonna get like the, the armor, like three hours later. I like liberating like a small coastal town. Okay, who else is left? There's There's one guy's house intact. That's the guy who was working with the pirates. Hands down. He tipped them off to like the location and like doomed everyone here. Swim. Okay, I was about to say. It'd be kind of weird. <laughs> oh, the Zalfus horn that we get off him is amazing looking. Okay, the village is clear. There were so many enemies. Hmm? Can't hear the monsters anymore. They're gone. Rosal, everyone. Also, I killed their homeland. Like, I wiped them completely out. And I also killed their god. And I also killed them in hell. So, like, you guys are alarmingly safe now. Like, they're dead in, like, three different planes of existence. Some wanderer type showed up out of nowhere and took out every monster in the village all by himself. Oh, we haven't seen Bolson in a while, yeah. Look like a strong breeze could blow you over, but you are solid as stone. Extraordinary, that is what you are. Oh. So relieved that everyone in the village escaped uninjured. Still awful, all we could do was watch as the monsters overran our home. If not come, this village might have been ruined beyond repair. We all owe you a great debt, thank you so very much. Oh. Good news is not all, the houses have been destroyed. If we can work together, I'm sure we can rebuild. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're gonna restore the oh. town. Oh. Don't have anything I can give you as a reward, not with our village in shambles. Once the village is rebuilt, we'll be sure to show you just how warm our hospitality can be. Aww. Okay, I'm gonna have to help him rebuild the village. Yeah, side adventures. <laughs> no, wait, no, that one's done. Mm -hmm. Is there another one? Mm. Wait, I need you to collect 200 pieces of wood, Link. Oh. Like Tarry Town 2, where you gotta build it up. Mm. Built just charm. I can't wait to restore the restaurant and the lucky treasure shop to their former glory. Oh. Gonna need a rather large amount of logs and hot. Oh, it really is just gonna be. I need like 400 pieces of wood. <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. uh, how much? Mm. 15 logs. Get logs from other trees, not the palm trees. Mm. Also, I need a lot of rice oh. to fix the roofs. <laughs> okay, so we gotta we gotta help them restore this place. He wants logs. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to go into like the rainforest or something. Apparently, like, this is unacceptable.
Where, where do I even put the logs? Just pop them near them. Will he accept this as is? Hey, I brought a log. Doesn't like a oh, year so picky. All right. Dang, I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna get all the other logs. Just you wait. I'm gonna get the longest stick known to man. And use this as a base. Takes so long. Hang on, how far? Oh my god. Okay, just leave this log here. He really wants me to just bring them all from the forest. Okay, well, there's a small amount of trees up here. You can just pill for these. Use a horse? We don't, we're not using a horse. We don't need a horse. Hang on. Okay, we are gonna need... Use this as an axe. Okay, one... Buddy. Okay, two... They can't do anything. They're fighting back, but it's futile. <laughs> to preserve the logs. Now, everyone's apparently in this grove just trying to kill us. They don't want to go. They will be chopped. Oh my, why? Why is so many of you here? Just let me chop down the forest. in their home. Okay, let's, let's see how many we've got. There's four right here. Five. Okay, that, that's apparently coming with us now. That's all right. Six. Seven. Eleven logs. Okay, I now I've run out of trees in this part of the map. Which 
which is unfortunate. Wait, there's 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 still one standing. Those bananas. Oh, it's a cute little apple tree. Oh, no, you don't. Come construction material. Anyone see any more trees that we can like chop down? Mine there. Oh, there's some. Okay, perfect. He just make a bridge across this canyon. Actually, he's got a shot that didn't make it. All right, get some more. That's okay. They're really fighting back. <laughs> like the trees are coming alive. Didn't realize it was the forest of the ends here, right? Like, I'm just trying to get a, a few logs. I just want to make a big stick. This is so funny. One's on its way. It's just this last log here. Sell the tape on. I just got a a little more. Almost got this. Sell it, tape it. <laughs> it's a bit tricky. <laughs> okay. Raise her up. Okay, it's starting to fall a little bit. <laughs> how's, she, how's she looking? <laughs> She's... She's on her way! <laughs> almost, well, almost clear the mountains. Oh my god, I dropped it. Hang on. <laughs> Fuck, it got caught. I guess you want me to add this for a log collection. Yeesh, how about a hi, how you doing to go with it? Don't get wrong, I appreciate the whole amount of few words they but come out of right here. Yeah, go go ahead. Put put all these in. Mm. What? The 
Buddy! Did you not see the size of that one? Oh, oh you little... Oh. Oh. I wonder what those plans you had for these trees were. Just curious. Just curious. Oh wait, the stick's still here. Sorry, I'm just being an asshole. Yeah. Your lumber. <laughs> oh. mm -hmm. I'll take a few of these. Daniel, you kicked our dog again. Mm. Oh, he actually collected oh. the logs that time. Oh. Oh. He got most of them. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. <laughs> Okay, logs collect it. Oh. Oh. We just need to grab rice now. Um, I have no idea where to get the rice. Also need to get down here just so we can actually get the tier of the kingdom. Check inventory. I think I have a little bit of rice. Eight. I need it 20, wasn't it? Just cut grass. Can you actually get rice that way? Yes, you can. Never knew that. Let's just pillage the ecosystem. Gotta like <laughs> bring in the crops. It's gonna take a while. I'll, I'll I'll get cut in the grass as we go out to the tier of the kingdom. You just chop bits of grass along the way. Yeah, that, one, that one I have to go too. Buy rice. Apparently, you can just get it from this though too. It's probably easier because I doubt they're gonna have that much supply of rice. I never knew you could just get it by just cutting any grass. It's kind of wild. I mean, of course, it's gonna take a little bit longer, but we don't have to go like just scour every shop. Nobody cringes when you say Tear of the Kingdom. You know, the main opponent of playing even Breath of the Wild is that Link obtains the Breath of the Wild as he adventures, you know? Really, to save Zelda, it's what you have to collect. Sorry, to save the Legend of Zelda. You gotta call them, but it's the, like, you know, it's not just Mario. Super Mario. That's Super Mario. You know, you, that's how you have to refer to it. Have you guys played the Super Mario? That's the Super Mario 64. 
Hey, you gotta phrase it. Give me rice. Wait, what if I make a lawnmower out of engineering parts? Hang on. Can I even do that if I sellotape some swords on the side? And then we just uh, pop on a fan. Pop on a steering wheel too. We'll treat ourselves. Decrease. We gotta cut that grass. It, that's not cutting at all, is it? No. Okay. Uh, let me just get my weapons back before I waste any more resources. Well, this is gonna, this is gonna take a little while. Can you get the rice off of even this bit of grass? Or is that grass like magic grass? Oh, maybe. <laughs> Gotta keep mowing this lawn. Running out of lawn. Just it just stops. There's no more lawn past here. Yeah, how much? How much have I got? Fifteen. All right, we're almost there. Hang on. Doing it for the good of the village. They just need the, the, the yard cleaned up a bit. It's really bothering them. We're almost there. One more. And yeah, we can get back to finding the tier of the kingdom now. I'm guessing it's like down there by the end. Here, let me let me let me get my uh, lawnmower back. I can use this to just hitch a ride. Oh, this on down. At least, at least the lawnmowers serve in some function. Look out! Oh, there's just a small army at the end. Hang on. Oh, we don't want to fight that. We've been fighting so many small armies already. Give us a break. I don't think it was down there either. It seemed to run out. Go catch those birds, you know, though. Did anyone see the tear? Is 
must have been around here somewhere. Hey. Aha! Didn't destroy it for some reason. Oh, because it's raining. Okay. I have none of it. I thought there's a yahaha slumbering under there. Not ready to awaken just yet. Fan, maybe. Let me try that. Oh, there go, there goes the lawnmower. Oh, never mind, it sucks. Let's just keep going. Uh, anything over here? Is that it? Oh, that's gotta be it. Here, collect it. World's most creative RT build. I was, listen, I was trying to build a lawnmower, right? <laughs> I reckon it might still work, but I, I lack the, the brains to construct it. Are you gonna upgrade your eyebrow? I'm working on it. <laughs> Sonia's not dead again. All right, Zelda. We are alone as you requested. What was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? <laughs> you are far too trusting. Oh! <laughs> oh my. Schmeld us up I'm to no good. I'm to hear you say such a thing. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you... Are a puppet of Ganondorf. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? <sighs> I should probably tell people this is a thing. Oh, that's... okay, that's how they got her. Jesus. You just teleported behind her. Hang on, we're all right. We're... It's struggling. But it's staying afloat. Hang on, let me get my trap back. We're all right. My PC is having some hardware trouble or something. Like, um... I got, like, uh... You know... Like, everything turned, like, kind of black and purple? Is how I would describe it? I don't know why it's struggling so much. It shouldn't even be, because, like, I'm not even playing, like, a PC game, you know? It's just capture card. Um. So, I, yeah, I just gotta, like, I, I'll have a look at it later, and I'll figure out what's going on. Yeah, thanks, just thanks for bearing with me as ever, gang. Thanks for bearing with me. 
bitrate should be back. It says it's unstable at the moment. I'm hoping you guys can see, okay? I just paused it here. Ganon had a big happy smile. That's it. <laughs> I was like, you know, like the face the heavy makes from TF2 when he's like shooting his minigun? Like, that's that face. Sonya is caught by treachery. That didn't go well for her. It's still, there's still a lot more memories though. We, we know how it ends. Because we just grabbed the Master Sword. But we're still missing like a fair bit. Did you replay it? Did you, did you just not see it all? Okay, uh, hang on. Alright, let me, let me replay it then. Thanks for bearing with me, gang. All right, Zelda. We are alone. We can see the funny face again. What was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? <laughs> you are far too trusting. <laughs> oh my. I'm surprised to hear you say such a thing. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you are a puppet of Ganondorf. Did you really think we hadn't realized Careful, the, the stream deceit? might be backstabbed. Like, straight up, he's just suddenly there. <laughs> well, we gotta watch her die again. Pictures. <laughs> like actual Gary's mod expression. It's great. I don't, I don't know why they did that, but it's great. I'm glad they did. Okay, let's uh let's go deliver the rice. The face you make with tears of the kingdom comes out. Oh god. Big happy smile. The dev team was like no keepers. Like someone must have mentioned it at some point. Must have. Yeah, here you go. Here's your rice. Do the foundation work and check the state of the buildings while I'm at it. I'll be back before you know it. He's gonna be like the king of this town now, similar to like President Hudson. Investing in real estate. Oh. Okay, sorry for the wait. Foundations are nice and solid. Now it's time to move on to repairing the buildings. Five buildings that need fixing. Three of them are establishments, the inn, the restaurant, and the lucky treasure shop. Two of them are homes, the village heads house, and the arms house. Our process will depend on the building we're working on, so explain once you decide where we start. 
Oh, this- so this is gonna take, like, actually forever. You have to rebuild the entire town. Like, if I try build- rebuild the treasure shop. Okay, it's charming spot. We can explain what we need to fix that place up. So the rest of it is fast, is it? Okay. Upon a time, a palm tree grew up through the building's second story roof. It's to be a bit of a landmark because of that, but now, well, the damage is worse than I thought. It has to be a central pillar. It's crucial support for a building. I already used the logs you collected to shore up the foundation. Oh. Because we use a log from a palm tree as a central pillar. The building is big, so rather than connect the roof and floor, the palm tree log would go in the plant pot on the second floor and through the hole in the roof. Okay, so I, I I just gotta pick it up. Okay. All right, you'll do. I just need you to fix like a minor thing in each home from here, Link. Come on. Come on. There you go. Maha. It's perfect. Yeah, that's that's the heavy lift that done, you know. We don't need windows or anything. IRT, first time cheering, can we put Ganondorf face cam in the bottom right? <laughs> Give me, give me one second. Just take a moment just to set up. Yeah, I need to need to get him looking at the game though, so we'll flip him. There we go. <laughs> he's he's just having so much fun playing. <laughs> Welcome to Ganon Gaming. <laughs> ah, the shafts are stored. Oh. Neat. I wasn't sure the monster had done my shopping. Oh. Ah. Yeah, the place is, place is back to normal. <laughs> Look how happy Ganon is. You lucky treasure shop is back in business. <laughs> if you don't even need ru rupees. You can be broke and still come on in and try your luck. Doors are open starting now. So they're really grateful. Ah. Just take advantage of them completely. Let's see what's in the shop. This is just parts? <laughs> oh. oh, you get to pick a chest. And crack one open and you just see what you get, basically. It's a gambling house. Perfect for me. Oh. Only five rupees. Oh no, okay, ah. no, it's not just that. <laughs> he takes the rupee back. But you can just get like monster parts in that, that's cool. Oh. And you have to wait. Oh. You got a roasted porgy in that pouch, don't you? Oh, sure. <laughs> oh, it'll let you play again if you have a porgy. Sure. No 
one sec. Give me one second. Hang on. Bear with me. Promises for your wall. It's, it's the same face. <laughs> it's the same. <laughs> They're doing a squad stream. <laughs> They're all just playing together. They're having such a good time right now. <laughs> I didn't know they used Source to, to make Tears of the Kingdom. Okay, let's 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 rebuild the town. Anna and the Heavy are gonna play like Animal Crossing. <laughs> Legend of Silent at Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, uh, so stupid. I'm gonna pop them away. They're too distracted for me. They're too distracted. It's a puddle of rainwater. Mm -hmm. Clear to the debris. You killed them. Why is it always raining? more in there, isn't there? I think I was supposed to use the other pieces to get it. Go. There we go. They could they can drain out the house now. Bali, thank you for a thousand bits. Leave Ganondorf on screen, but like 64 by 64 pixels in the corner. Like he's so small. But, like, you wouldn't even know he's there. <laughs> he's always watching. No, he's still distracted. I, I, I can't do it. Just knowing that he's there, I'm gonna just, like, start laughing. <laughs> I can't. It's a Ganon water <laughs> Okay, yeah, new oh. new house. <laughs> the inn is here. Ah. Ma. Yeah, another establishment, the restaurant. No one needs to live here first. Mm. Mm. I wonder what the reward is for doing all this. Oh. Like a series of little missions. Hmm. Central pillar is broken, so we have to repair it pronto. I already shored up the building's foundation using the logs you collected. Place a log from the palm tree through the holes in the roof and floor. Oh. Okay, give us a palm tree. I guess this is what his idea was for the village. Oh, my up here. Hang on. Get it through. Hang on. There we go. Maha.
and use Ganon's face as a sensor. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I got an idea. Hang on. Cannon. Back. <laughs> it's so simple, but like... Like, do not look at the stream right now. <laughs> Sick album cover. Canator of a pod visited Link's fuckhouse. Oh no. Okay, ah, oh, the restaurant's repaired. Yeah, we're, we're helping all the, like, like all these people have been like displaced from their homes. Hi. Doing a lot of good work right now. Okay, we gotta build two more homes. Probably just gonna be another palm tree, isn't it? it? It seems like most of them is just put a palm tree in it. Oh. Hmm. Oh. Don't mind the island just hovering over here. I think that's another boss arena too. Yeah, it is. I'm still kind of living in hope that there's like a Queen Gliok or something like that. Just because we've already defeated two of the kings. But I also kinda doubt it. Maha. Yo, just like a next level, it's a one of one kind of thing. <laughs> Like the silver gliok or something, you know? Okay, another house restored. Mm -hmm. Right now, I'll have a comfy place to sleep at night. Ah. Yeah, well, well, welcome back, gang. Mm. Village is all coming together. I mean, this is really cute. This does give me like Tarry Town vibes. But like, you have to help with construction. I do appreciate that you don't need to gather resources for every single home. I think there's more houses in this one too. I don't remember a treasure shop or anything in like Breath of the Wild. Oh. Like this is just cute. Like you can actually see like the the area being restored. Oh. There's a lot of that in this game too. Like like a lot of the times you visit the areas, they're like. There's something wrong with them at first. But then you like restore order and that and like the region transforms. Like even like the Rito. Going from like the freezing cold. I, I kind of like that. Like it marks your progress better. You know? You can see like the effect you've had on the world. Here we go. Maha. It's like you're actually doing something. Like, that's the thing. Like, we've gone from, like, invaded town destroyed by pirates to actually reconstructing it. That's like a fun little side quest. That's cool. Another house restored. Ah. 
<laughs> just have my people here in the village. But I really owe you for fixing my house. I have extras to share. I'll put them in front of my house. Please take whatever you need. Mm -hmm. Olsen, is it true? Ah. But it is. Every last building in the village is as good as new. <laughs> I ever thank you and think you restored the village so quickly. The feast is most certainly in order tonight. Ah, oh, bless. Pounds reinstate it. Look at this. Huh. The day the pirates attacked and overran the village, I was desperate to get everyone to safety. But now that we're here, 45 minutes later, and the entire town has been restored instantly. It's been a hell of a journey. I wouldn't have it any other way. <sighs> Everyone fled. The only sound coming from Lurland Village was the sound of monsters. Never thought, never dared dream. Live to see the day we could all laugh together again like this. Oh, well, right now, it's all thanks to you. I'm extremely grateful to Bolson as well. Oh. I need to thank me after all when I first drifted into this village. You all welcomed me with open arms, didn't you? This work I did here, it's just my way of paying that kindness oh. back. Olsen's chill. You're this village's savior. Oh. Talked about this with the rest of the folks around here. We do not have enough money or treasure to repay you for saving our home. Oh. The treasure we do have, well, it's this village and everyone in it. From now on, we'll do everything we can to share our hospitality with you. Village of Savior, I'll provide a bed for free anytime. Uh. Also, welcome to eat at the restaurant as much as you like, free of charge, of course. This, this is some pretty good perks. Uh. Village of Savior may not need to test his luck, but I'm sure it'd be fun to play a treasure chest game once in a while. Oh. Please feel free to take anything you find in the village. Ah, oh, bless. You get, like, services as the reward. It's cool. Oh. Oh. Lively, it's time for the... Oh. Mm -hmm. Lurlin Revival Dance. Da, da, da. Sure. What? What? Look at them go. It's cute. Oh, but anything cynical to say. Like, it's it's cute. S2 could never. <laughs> that was very wholesome. Like, the village is just restored now. But We can just use here for free. Do I get a fancy bed? My special salt spot will soothe your body and soul. You have to just bring oh. some salt. Let's try it. <laughs> Got some knots back here. Soon you'll feel fresh as a coastal breeze. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Rise and shine! But the rise evil, you woke up right on schedule. Good side means your body got all the rest it needed. Come back to the salt spa soon! <laughs> oh, Jesus. So sorry, this <laughs> is so, so, so mature. <laughs> yeah, we got extra hearts for that. That's good. We can get that for free now. Oh, it costs salt. What should I cook next? Can I, so, can I just pill for the restaurant? Is there food? Hi. What have you got for us? <laughs> ah. I was surprised my customers with meals they've never had before. Mm -hmm. Oh, hang on, my bag is full. Maybe you just consume, consume a fish. Ah. 
seafood paella. That's cool. <laughs> I was putting unique di dishes on my menu, so do come again. She'll teach you, like, cooking recipes and stuff like that. That's cool. I like that. Yeah, what a cute little side quest. The village is all back together again. It's paella. L listen. We don't discriminate. We pronounce it all wrong, okay? I'm trying. I'm trying. There's still- why is there no shrines here? Like, what happened? Look how, like, the void this area is. Like, we must have missed a lot. Oh, there was a chest on the beach too, wasn't there? Hang on, let's go pick that up. I guess it sank. Hang on. What happened? Can't find my dad's blue shirt. It's dad's favorite thing. But so much he put it into an iron chest so no one would take it. The pirates sank it, so it's probably in the base. It's too heavy to float away. Oh, okay, there, there's some boxes here. Oh, I see how it is. Okay. Hang on. Let me let me just get a long stick real quick. It's not long enough for that. What do we make the stick even longer? Passing it all together. <laughs> Almost got it. I think I can just stand on this like wreckage now. Though. Grab it. Or I can just unfasten the stick. Probably gonna be this one. Oh, jeez. Okay, bring it back to the shore. They just dropped all their treasure from the pirate ship for some reason. Island Lobster shirt. Oh, it's the Wind Waker shirt. That's actually so cute. Because heat resistance, too. Look at that. The Bread of the Wild shirt is even based off. That's cute. Little man's back. Just show up like wearing this. Question, can I upgrade it? Can you actually upgrade it? No. Uh, and it's useless. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, here you go. I found the shirt. Oh, uh. mistake! This is Dad's blue shirt. Thank you, Mister. I gotta go tell my dad. Hey! Do I get to keep it? I imagine so. Uh. Yeah, I found your shirt. Uh. It smells like you. Saving uh. villagers finding lost items. What can't you do? My trusty blue shirt. When I was a young man, I used to wear it all the time. I haven't put it on since the boy's mom started picking out my clothes. It's a shame to keep that beauty in a moldy old chest, though. Say, would you want it? 
Ah, so you just get to keep it now. Well, that's cute. Make your dad proud, you know that? Very, very proud. Is our dad the little man? <laughs> little man's all growing up now. He's made it big in the influencer world. Yeah, there's another treasure chest here. He's a big man now. Just have money? Sure. Why not? <laughs> Has RT done any of the plot? Uh, not in like the last four hours. <laughs> we've uh, we, we've we've been on a bit of a tangent, you know. We we've been having a good time. We did get a tear. We we cleared out Pirate Island. That's that's gotta account for something. And we found no shrines whatsoever in this entire expanse. Okay, let me let me go get some sundelines. Uh, I'm trying to think like where I even found some before. I think I found some over here before. There's like a few different ones in the sky. I want to see if I can go back to the Lightning Island. Maybe that might be a good note to end it on. But I I don't know how to actually clear the storm yet. We haven't found anything. We just straight up haven't found anything that actually helps us. I'm surprised there was nothing in the rainforest down below. I could try just fly back into it, but that, that feels really dangerous. That's how much we trust our vehicles. There's a Sunderline. I only need one more. Where is it? Only need one. Come on, game. Take pity. Take pity. Not that big a deal. I could go to Hatno Village and finally get the shrine detector. Maybe that actually might help us. I'm trying to think, like what 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 do you feel like doing? Like we could we could go on like a tears mapping route of the kingdom. And get all of them. There's the Sunderline. We could try and get to Thunder Island. I like the sounds of one of those two, honestly. Uh, where is the Great Fairy Fountain? It was here. Save the President's Daughter. <laughs> She'll be fine. Listen, like, look, if she's... If she's in danger, she's already dead at this point, right? Which means that if she hasn't died, she's still alive and could wait a bit longer, okay? But I wouldn't worry. Because she's already... Like, I wouldn't worry because she's either fine or she's already dead. And in either circumstances, there's nothing we need to do. <laughs> so just don't, don't worry about it. Ants away. And finally get... Level 4 champion's letters, which is 32 armor. That's insane. There goes Link again. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm not getting. No, I'm not putting the sensor back. <laughs> we have 59 armor. That's so good. The hood, we can get it up to 64. I wonder if I can upgrade the hood already. I, I'm only missing Amber. <laughs> oh, of all things. If I upgrade that, then I get up to like 72 armor. It's crazy good though, ain't it? Can't sell the Amber anymore. Okay, so 64 armor is pretty good. Like, that's just gonna... That's gonna keep us alive. We have so much kit. We have so much kit. Oh, we could also just figure out what the fuck's going on in Kakariko. That might be worth checking out too. We've kind of just like ignored them, but we've also like stumbled upon their town. Yeah, we could do that. Did you fight King Gliok yet? Yes. Twice. <laughs> we're doing- we're doing good. Okay. So we had something for the rings. One of the rings is just blocked off, but I'm not entirely sure how to even access it. Uh, let me see. Adventure log. Where was it? Like, so much here. Oh, I need to tell the shopkeep that the village is safe now as well. Like, because she's just worried sick. We've just, like, not said anything. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. She thinks her entire family is dead. We've, like, taken the time to restore the entire village. It's down here? Uh, oh, memories. Side quests, shrine quests. So many missions. Still need to go to the research lab. That that might be important to do. That's the messages from the ancient era. Where is it? I, there was one where it's like, you need to read all the ruins. I don't see it. It's on main quest. Princess Sightings. It's just a personal one. Yo, I'm not sure what to do. I've I've already got some of the ring runes. Side quest, not side adventure. It's weird how they distinguish them. Treasure hunt. Hidden treasure. Minecart land. We haven't gone back to minecart land in a while. Trip through history. That's the one. So we have three left to, to grab. Hey, hey, how you doing, gang? Uh... Ciphered slabs. Yep. We protected Hyrule from the Demon King together, King. They were known sages. I take from this is that it's about a facet of Hyrule as it was in those days. Where to guess at how to fill in the gaps is go something like, there were those known as sages who protected the kingdom of Hyrule from the Demon King. That's another one, yeah? Three more to tell them about. I gotta go back and report on them at some point. 
go talk to him and just see where I, I don't think I've gone into the big one there either. Haven't really spent too much time. Is this your man? Yeah, I read what's on a slab. Here you go. It's two left. I read what's on another slab. I read another one. Oh, you told me that already. Okay, there's two left. I think there's one up there, and then there's probably this big one here. I don't really know what to do for the big one because, like, there's someone just saying, "Hey, don't, don't do that." I'm not really sure how to, like, if I can just like put a bucket on their head or something, stop them. Oh, I don't have tool in here for some reason. Oh, there's a Korok in here. Hey, come back here. Yeah. I need to do another quest or something before. I mean, like, maybe? Like, I'm, I'm not really sure, though. We don't really know what's going on with the rings here. They kind of just appeared. Up we go. Keep on moving. One of them says, fuck you. <laughs> this is ancient Hylian, we must decipher it. Like, oh, oh, this guy was pissed. Okay, large room. Store the slab in a tent at the nearby camp. One is just like a basic, like, highly an emoji they were fond of. We think it means no big deal, but it's hard to decipher. It's Sky Islands. Uh, ending a live up there. New species of plants. Go on to go there. Oh. Try talking to Cory, she's our resident plant expert. Trying to cultivate plants that were attached to the ruins. Okay. Ah. Huh. Oh. Okay, we're gonna we'll just leave him to it. There might be a ruin in I mean they said they moved it into a tent, but we're just gonna quickly check what's in here anyway. Chest up here. I thought I saw one. One says hot vi in your area. <laughs> Some of them are just like spam emails. Felt the need to inscribe those two. Okay, uh, where's the tent? Oh, there it is. Hang on. Demon King, vast power, no hope, victory, king's own life, manage and prison him. Imprison not indefinitely, prepare demon revival. We sages must leave our knowledge for future generations. In between the lines, the stone slab seems to be a record of how the king in those days challenged the demon king. The reigning king determined that they were no match for the demon king and gave his own life to imprison the threat. Just tried to leave something for the people of the future who would have to prepare for the demon king's revival. Okay, there's only one left then. Um, and the problem is if it's in there, I'm not gonna be able to touch it because your man gets angry. That area is fenced off as you can see.
And he's got pinpoint precision in picking you out from the sky. He's not letting you near. I don't think I'm going to be able to get the last one then. I read another slab. Like, I, because I think that's the last one that's missing. There's only one left. That's yeah, annoying because there's, there's something in there. Like, why else would they like lock it like this? You know, I don't I don't know how I get around them. Does he give any other insight? No, she didn't say anything. <laughs> Use a puff shroom, just confuse him. Oh, it's not that one, it's the one at the entrance of the village, is it? Did I miss one? No, I, I got the one at the... You mean this one? I got that one. Gotten that one. I think I went and got that one. Just got that one. Is that one. I think. I think I got them all. There's five rings. Yeah, there's, there's, there's one there, but we can't get to it. Yeah, there's, there's, there's one that we just can't get. Get a piece of heart here as well. Grab this while we're here. Please, I beg you, end stream. I have exams. I need to sleep. You're not allowed to leave. No. I don't care. You have to stay here. Until the end of the broadcast. Or you'll fail your exam. I'll make sure of it. I'm a Twitch.tv streamer. I have power. I have influence. I will speak to your examiner and he will fail you. Join us for the next seven hours of The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the King. Okay, I got that one, right? I just got that one. We just got this one. I think I got that one, which, that's the, that's the only other ring. There's no others either. I don't think I can get any more. There's only five rings. I went to the one up there, I went to the one there, I went to the two other ones. I've, I, I, there's five rings, I've, I've given them four, there's one left, I think it's there. Yeah, like, this guy... Picks you out of the air if you're even flying near it on the other side. Like, I don't think there's even a stealth option for this. Not possible. We made a little bit of progress on the scrolls here. Preferred to go on that. I don't know if I have any more of the hand in here. Oh. No, I have no more. You only gave him three. I gave him one before, guys. Gave him one before. No, you didn't. I did it off stream, and I've sent this, guys. I've... I did it off stream. Just leave it, okay? There's five rings. We can't access one. There's something there. We'll check it later. We'll check it later. We'll check it later. 
supposed to end at four. We'll check it later. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I, I, I did that one. I did that one. I did that one. Maybe there. I could... I'll check real quick. I'll check real quick. I gave him one off stream. I'm pretty sure. All right, guys, keep gaslighting. <laughs> I could have sworn I did. I did the one at, like the start of the runes. I, I think I picked one up here. Maybe there's none in that secret ring. Maybe it is only just four. I can have a little look. It'll be up here if it's anywhere. Go. Have you have you left a book for me? Yeah, ring research. Gloom. Damn it! The herb in question was a yellow plant stumbled upon in my previous research. You're likely a new species. Yeah, they got a cure for the gloom. We'll see if that does it. If it does, then apologies there. Could have sworn that I already did it, though. I thought I even had done that one before. No, you told me that already. It was not the slab. Oh, no, it's the translation, right? Sorry. It's been a long stream. I, I am a little bit tired. <laughs> I am a little tired. I do want to keep going just a little bit further, though. Just a little bit more. Oh, there's the dragon going again. Okay, back up the hill. Have you eaten all day? I had a big meal before I started the stream. Don't worry about me there. Okay, there's another camp. Here, maybe. Dragon's just doing its thing. Okay, wind, flame, water, lightning, and time, light. Equals the power of secret stone. And that person dwell within power, amplified, great might, display. The thrust of the message in this slab is about something called secret stones. Those who hold power such as wind, flame, water, lightning, and light, and time, amplified them with secret stones. They'd use the stones to attain great might to accomplish their goals. I'm guessing it would say if we could read the whole thing. Translation get. It's literally just Thanos. Maybe all this happened because someone used the stones to destroy the stones. What's this guy even doing? He's just running. Okay, another stone. There were once ble people blessed by wind, fire, light, water, and lightning, as well as time and light. These people use secret stones to amplify their powers. They must have had some pretty amazing rocks way back then, huh? That was the fort one. Wait a second. Look at all those uh, slab messages together. Don't they read, like, one single message? I don't think, could the rest of the message be on a slab in the floating ring rune? Why? Hmm. Possible trying to figure this stuff out is making my head hurt. One sightseer to another, I'd like to reward you with one of my personal favorite travel necessities. Have some butterflies. Okay, so the last one is on that, but we're still not going to be able to access it. Hmm. 
Yeah, like, I still can't access it. That's a shame. Try Pyre. Uh, maybe I can talk to the Elder? Like, yeah. The Chieftain. It's Pyre. Oh, hey. Can you give me access? No, she doesn't say anything. I don't know how to get in there. Yeah, I mean, there's... There's gotta be something. Maybe it's just locked behind plot. Yeah, like, it could just be, it's like, well, if you clear... Like, have you fixed things in the desert yet, Link? Can't fly down from above. No, like, we, we, we tried that. He actually just picks you out of the sky. There's no... You can't just sneak around. If you cross that rope... He, like, freaks out. So we'll have to work our way back to that to see what's happening. Ah, uh, what do we want to do now? We have a bit of time left. What are we feeling, gang? We're not doing a new area. No, and I'm, like, I'm not going like off to the desert because that that that's going to be too much. Um, I can see where the tears are. Maybe we can wrap up the tears and then check in with input and co. Uh, I need to check, like, the, the album, the picture. Yeah, there's one off on the right there. I, I can kind of just cheekily dip my toes in there. Those two there as well. Okay, we'll do, we'll do, like, a tears run. And we'll get them all, okay? This one is, like, over here. Let's head to our house and we'll set up a little flying machine. You get the Koroks on Eventide? Who cares? <laughs> Who cares? I, I've missed, like, there's so many of the fuckers. They're everywhere. I'm never gonna get them all. I'll never find them. I'll be there for, like, the rest of my life searching for them. Okay, we're gonna just fly across the world. Get these tears. Away we go. See if we can mark off any shrines just along the way. I mean, there's probably some. There's definitely one over there. Just gonna keep taking me up. Probably just make my way up there, couldn't I? It's like a shattered ledge. Something way above them, too. I feel like that might be like Zora questline territory or something like that, though, if I had to guess. We're gonna steer clear. Stay true to our mission here. Just tears run. We'll get around to this area later. This is probably the last one we do. Because I, th I think on the next Zelda stream, like, we're going to tackle the desert. See it there. Hey, you serve me well, flying machine. Down it goes. Yeah, what is happening there? I think everything's in stasis. 
Yeah, especially with like all the waterfalls here, like it has to be like a Zora quest line where it's like get the armor and go on up. Maybe they go to Kilton for the monster diorama. So some stuff like that, I'm gonna tackle like bits of that in my off time. Uh, it's like tomorrow I've actually got like a proper day off outside of a few edits. And so I'm just gonna like give things a look and like probably just play a little more. Like I might just find some more shrines. Won't do anything new, like, in areas we haven't really gone to yet, as ever, like, you know, general rule. I might just do, like, a bit more of an explore of, like, that mountain stuff. Journey across the underground a little bit more. We see the tear. It's right there. Time to the stream start? Uh, if you type exclamation point schedule, you can get it all there. You can also check the description of every video on the YouTube channel. It's always there. And if anything changes, I post in the Discord. Okay, let's see, uh... And Ga Ga Ganon might- oh, he's a bit big here. Hang on. Ganon's gonna be excited to see what's happening here. King Raru. <laughs> We just received word that the last free village in the Gerudo Desert has fallen. Live Ganon reaction. <sighs> At this rate, the Demon King's army will overwhelm us. <laughs> He's so happy. I understand. Our only hope is for me to defeat the Demon King. Raru. The Demon King. He is not someone you can stop by Where did yourself. you go? Because you weren't in the final battle or anything, were you? I don't know. But you are not alone. He's like separate to the sages in that. You have the Gerudo, <laughs> you can see all the others, see? Nora, and Rito leaders, as well as Zelda. And of course, you can count on... He was on there, okay. Maybe she was. Ganon is ecstatic to see this all go downhill. There's something I'd like to show you all. I am guessing this is before things got really bad for the gang. Oh, this is the temple where the map is, isn't it? Stand with me. I need all your aid. There's only four stones. I was thinking there was six or something just because there's six sages. Don't get. Ganon's gonna pick these up later and he knows it. And once again, ecstatic that he's going to get to kill them all. <laughs> he already knows what's happening. <laughs> Not a cult. <laughs> okay, we got two more tiers to pick up, and then we'll check in with Impa. Is there a shrine here at all? Very far out. I guess it's not the worst thing, actually, if we don't have a shrine. We'll just give us, it'll give us reason to come back and explore. There's one, like, near here on the map. Have you had the shrine sensor? <laughs> I need to get to the lab. 
<laughs> I've ignored it so long. Okay, uh, maybe a faster way to get here? Uh, actually, I'm wondering where the thing is. It was like around here on the map, wasn't it? Kinda? Towards the end of a lake. It's over here, so it's, it's over that way, okay. We're just we're just going quick so we can get these tears. And we'll report back to input just to see what happens. We might as well pick up the last of them. Played a considerable amount of game of the game at this point. I still feel like there's so much to do though. I, I know we've done a lot at this point, but like, I still feel like I've like only scratched the surface. There's so much more to go. Does anyone see it? Should be around here somewhere. Hard to see because of all this bloom. We're just gonna we're gonna treat ourselves to um to just a big battery. If we get to the top, we might be able to see it better. Cold. It's about to get unbearably cold. <laughs> hey, where where is it? And there's one on the other side of these mountains too. The flying machine really does make it easy to just navigate the world. Like you can use this with like the battery to even get some of the stuff in the sky. Feel like we've probably gone past it a bit, maybe we're over here. I see a shrine down there. We're just gonna keep going higher for a while. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, we can abandon the flying machine from here. That is it, right? That one we've got. Oh, I miss it. Yeah, it was on top of the big stone. We we might have overshot it just a little. We might have gone past it just a bit. That's all right. We'll get them all. Bloom does make it hard to see.
I remember there was like an awful like blood moon quest you had to do up here before. It's like you had to you could only unlock a shrine if it was a blood moon and you were standing outside it. Took forever to do. Oh, Impus actually made it out here too. For our friend. It's the last shrine I got. Yeah, like I think it was for me too. Like it just took forever. Now, does anyone see the tear? Get a better view. You zoom on this, preserves your height. Or at least a little bit. There it is. It's right next to them, too. Like, Impa's gonna be like, how could we possibly find it? Where could it be? Inches from it. Okay, but only one more after this. Let's see what we get. I'm watching for the whole day, just vibing and unlocking emotes. Oh, you had a good time. I know it's been some long streams lately. I'm just having a lot of fun. Don't worry if you can't catch them all. Well, this is before things got really bad. They're just going for like a nice tea. <laughs> Seems like an extreme use of power. Are you well? You seem a bit distracted. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts, thinking about how I can return home. With your power over time, if I were able to learn that kind of control, I might be one step closer to my era. I see. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was? how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax it back to that original moment in time. The object's memory. I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. And it's like, no, she won't, lol. There is more on your mind than just that. Huh? You, of course, do want to get back to your time. But... You also desperately want to help us out in this era. Am I close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonia. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen, you can focus your attention on returning home. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Both of these powers will help you protect your own ear. Except Ganondorf's stab. He's gonna get a sick Queen warlock Sonia. punch in. That's why he's so happy. And of course, you must make it home safe to put Link's mind at ease. Link? Uh, that is not a name I have heard. He is a royal knight. He had been originally appointed for my protection. But later, he became a hero by saving both me and Hyrule from a great evil. Oh, a hero is he? He is so very dedicated, and he refuses to back down from any challenge. <sighs> he is very strong. <laughs> and his heart is good and true. Bless. Ah, I can see that you have absolute faith in him. Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Don't worry, you will. Indeed. Yeah, I would also like to Since meet you're him. you're dead and you know he steals your arm. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture. It's a cannon's like, you will soon. <laughs> 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 I 
I'll get you the link, don't worry. <laughs> okay, there's one left. We're gonna just zip on over to it. Also, thank you for the thousand bits. Thank you very much for the kind words, too. Hope you enjoy playing the game yourself, too. I yeah, hope you're having a good time with it. By all means, like, catch up on the VODs and that later if you want. Like, you know, everyone enjoy it their own way. I, I just really want to play this myself. It's kind of all I have on the brain for, for this year. As far as games go. It's for a good old while. Okay. We have one more pit stop to make. We're just gonna fly on over. Nice, gentle climb across the mountains. Oh, Ganon, Ganon's coming with us. Sorry, Ganon. <laughs> this, is, this is our adventure through the mountains. Yeah, so I, I think this is the last one. I think you can even see in the adventure log. We have one left to investigate. Oh, we just wanna- yeah, we wanna just keep going south. We'll treat ourselves to another big battery here. Last tier of the kingdom. Surely we're gonna get some kind of extra revelation cutscene when we gather all these. We should probably tell Impa, <laughs> like, hey, that dragon, though. <laughs> Thinks just kind of keeping that knowledge to himself. Sideways a bit faster like this. Link wants the dragon parts first. <laughs> yeah, like, I wanted to tell you sooner, but I just need to farm these materials, you know? I need to upgrade my trousers. Oh, those, I. I those shards of Zelda, like, they sell for a lot in the market. Oh god, wait, hang on, it's here. Uh... Oh, I see it. Just taking the view here, though, too. Something's happening over the desert, yeah, look how bad the sandstorm is. That, that kid did not make it to the, to the town, did they? There's no way. There's no way they made it okay. They were torn a uh, sun. <laughs> That's terrible. Even in the spirit of Tarrytown conventions. Allow me to offer you my deepest apologies. This is the last flashback. On behalf of the Gerudo. Oh, when is this? Taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom. To serve it faithfully. A welcome appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of They Hyrule. don't know what I know. 
I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth, well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. <coughs> your majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. Hmm. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. Uh oh All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. <laughs> Your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. And what future endeavors they're gonna be, am I right? <laughs> King Roru. I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Just his name, even that, it gives me pause. Zelda should be like, hang on, I am well aware who's a guy called Calamity nature. Ganon? For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. <sighs> there is nothing to worry about. Just not mentioning it. Okay. Ganon Ganondorf related? That must be a common name, you know. <laughs> Doesn't want a time paradox. Well, she's been very forthcoming with a lot of information. You know, she's straight up just using an iPad to save people at points, too. I wouldn't worry there. Oh! Hey Zelda, how you doing? There's another tear. Oh, it's over there for some reason. Okay. Sure. One last tier, and then we'll go chat the Impa. It's like, what was that all about? This is the tier of the kingdom. Now oh, let's get. Always just, I feel like naked unless I'm getting like my good armor on. <laughs> just in case something happens. Okay, here we go. Against my power, cannot save you from me. 
The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. After all, you possess more than power over time. So we, we've pieced a lot of this together already. You can dispel evil. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. Minoru, I'm counting on you. Is Aminoru still in the picture? At least we know that. Where did she go? There's still more there. Link, I will restore the Master Sword for you. I will care for it until the time comes. I will pour my sacred power into it. It will. Be the weapon that defeats the Demon King. In the pad. Oh, she's the Poe. Didn't even think about that, actually. Yeah. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. Hang on to that sword. She goes. And you have to wait for all the time to pass. The come on back. The modern day. Hey, so the champions hadn't perished at that point. The champions didn't die in the fight. They're not? <laughs> yeah, they didn't. Yeah, it's just the king. The king gave his life for it. Champions were okay. We might still be missing a, a memory from the battle. All oh, the silent princess flowers everywhere. Dragon's tears complete. She's heading off somewhere, is she? No, I think she's she might just be on her trip. It looked like she was heading to that tower for a moment. Oh, sweet crafting materials! Did 
This is where it loads on the market. Got 83 now, nice. <laughs> there she goes. Do I go back to Impa at all, or...? Buying Princess Zelda is still an objective. Nope, but... I don't know what else we do. Light Dragon. So, uh, uh, so no, that's another one for the album. <laughs> Okay, I think we leave it there for tonight. I think we leave it there. Um, but, it's been a good one, gang. I hope you all enjoyed the stream tonight. Thank you so much for coming by. Uh, thank you to everyone who subbed. If you ever gave bits. If the mods has ever been on hand. I hope you all enjoyed it. Oh, it's gonna be a bit weird displaying just because the like I crashed a few times, isn't it? I don't think it's gonna play the Credits proper. I don't think it will. I think it's probably going to miss bits of it. It might string it together if we were fast enough on Twitch. Maybe it will. Maybe we might be okay. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming by. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna leave it there for tonight. We're gonna return with Zelda on Thursday. Uh, on Tuesday, we're gonna be doing a Bloomin' Business Casino sponsor. Uh, it's a Casino simulation game. Not a gambling game, a casino simulation game. Uh, so that should be good fun. Uh, we played it before on stream, had a great time with it. We've very kindly been sponsored to play it again. Gonna check it out. Get something a bit different in. But yeah, then we'll do, we'll do more Zelda as well in, uh, Thursday, uh, next weekend. I reckon maybe next weekend we might finish the main story. Honestly. I think we'll do one stream for the Zora, one stream for the uh, Gerudo. Gerudo. How do you pronounce him? Uh, off stream, I'm only gonna just like discover some shrines. Tackle maybe just a few side quests, like kind of some of the more smaller stuff. Just do some exploration in general. Uh, I won't touch any of the new areas that we've yet to go to. The way I've always done it. The way I get to kind of play a bit and relax. And then we save all the good stuff for stream. It's pronounced Gerald. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Fucking Gerald. Yeah, I really hope everyone enjoyed the stream. It's been, it's been good fun. Hey, let me see. What else is going? The font is a bit weird, just because uh, it crashed. Don't mind it. Just does that. Uh, Kiwo's doing some RP. I'm just gonna leave you in Kiwo's care. Go wish you well. Go hang out. Go say hey. I'll see y'all Tuesday. Thank you so much for coming, folks. Have a good weekend.